All right, welcome in everyone. <clears throat> How are we all doing today? Got to finish set up here and then we will go digging dino, dino, dino digger or something like that. Dino dig, 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 dino. Whatever. Playing with dinosaurs and digging. Okay. Where were we? About 12 hours in. All right. Right. Okay. Okay. We were looking for a croissant, but we couldn't find one. So we're just going to go right into it and dig. And apparently scratch the dino on the tummy or the butt or something. dinosaurs hello yellow odd oh, nuts one dino dollar shy from a silver spoon uh is that necessary scratch scott's bottom ah much better can i do it again talk to Scott and see what Scott has to say. It must be the kids who scratched my itch. What a huge relief. Here, take this. We actually have too many of these things. I'm sure it'll come in handy one way or another. A hard hat. Stay safe, kids. Really can't thank you enough. Doot, 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 doot. Wait, is this a... It's gotta be a charm of some kind, right? Oh. More difficult than an easy hat. Wow. Wow. Okay, so it gives more defense, which is good because flashlight turn into a hard hat. You have the speed defense because we want him to have speed. You have the... Okay, yeah. Everybody has a different thing now. She's just straight up defense. She had the worst defense of them all, so she really needs it. Especially if she's going to have counter. Which is a pretty great thing. Okay. Screenshot. Check. Dead sprout? Sprout mole? Last time I tried Dino's Dig, I found lots of, er, an amazing treasure, but this time I tried it and got a granola bars. Artichoke, treasures on display here from all over the world. I want to travel the world someday. Can I see? A strange artifacts from different lands. Frog. Frog. I see frog. Frog is treasure. Chad! The food pyramid has a knack of finding lost things. Ancient artifacts, old relics, lost of time. Possibilities are endless. Who, who made, why, how, who? Oh, it's the parasaur on it. <laughs> the pterosaur on his back. All right, uh, you look like a shop. What? Hey there, little adventurers. Welcome to Dino's Dig. I'm Dido, founder of Dino's Dig. Ahem, are you hungry for treasure? Are you ready to have a spoonful of adventure? If so, you've come to the right place. Here at Dino's Dig, we've created the widest my money displayed. Ultimate, oh. Treasure hunting adventure, which you can experience for a low price of 100 clams. You are ready to enjoy the fun and excitement of digging for treasure? Sure, give me Dino Dastic! What? <laughs> what? <laughs> All right, kiddos, first things first. Here at Dino's Dig, we dig with spoons. That's why the spoons were on the sale. Since you don't have a spoon, I'll give you a potato spoon for free. Choose which spoon. P best choice. Here you go, right on, brother. You're a quick learner, aren't you? For special dig site food pyramid, 
you'll be able to uncover super rad treasure from all over the universe. The best part is you get to keep anything that you find. That's a dino guarantee. Let me tell you about our dig site. The food pyramid has four levels. You'll always start in the first. If you're lucky, you might find a pyramid key that unlocks the pyramid gate to the next level. The higher you go, the better treasure will be. Here's a catch. Each spoon has a limited amount of uses. For example, potato spoons will break after five times. Treasure ends when the spoon breaks. The gates will close. We'll call you back to the entrance. Yeah, makes sense. Dino Jastic! Time for your dino disclaimer. Treasure isn't the only thing you'll find here. You might find some troublesome critter critters looking for a fight. We aren't liable for damages to you or your property during the adventure you dig. Critter knocks you out during a battle, it'll be a real game over. Well, that's pretty much it. All that's left for you to do is go up these stairs, smell the sweet food pyramid in the air, and start digging. Have a dinotastic adventure. In the stairs, I'm already up. Strawberry worm? Strawberry snake. SS snake. A snake. Well, it's happy. Oh my god, what the 101 damage. Uh, excuse me. Oh, you have no, 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 no. Let's just, uh, let's get out of here, please. Couldn't get away. Oh my lord. Ow! Chocolate. Fries. Dino dollar. Oh, go away, go away. I mean, the hamburger bunny can't be that bad, can it? Dino dollar. Dino dollar. Another spoon bites the dust. Big spoon down, that's game over. Find a lot of cool treasure, hope you enjoy your dino-tastic adventure. Hey, chickeny thing. Yellow, I've got dino dollar, no, okay. Oh, you only take dino dollars, is that what this is? Total four dino dollars. I'll buy a spoon, point it out to me and I'll help you out. Twenty digs for ten dino dollars. No. Wooden spoon fifteen for six. Plastic ten for three. I mean, I guess it's not bad, but it's not ideal. Dang, I gotta grind levels or something. Let's heal up. Try that all again. If I can find a single snake, I might be able to do that. We'll try the bunny this next time though, because if I can get some of these battles done, that means eventually I'll be able to level up to the point where I get all of the battle done. Yes, I remember the rules. Dump, go, go, go. All right, what do you got? Bun Bunny. Bun Bunny! Okay. Didn't attack, has pretty low speed then. Hides in its button. Oh, but it has a lot of health. Ooh, no means when it does decide it's gonna attack, it's gonna hurt. Ow! Rude. Mm -hmm. 
loafing around. Alright. I'll see if there's any chance I can take this down. What if I hack away? I already know 75 is going to be enough. One battle. Okay. Now you should probably just attack, honestly. He's gonna attack a second time though. Yeah, there we go. 2714. One of those paid for the entire trip. Almost for both of the trips. Ricochet, huh? And homemade jam. Oh, sweet. Is that a resurrection spell? Because, yes. I don't know what you are. Dino dollar. Dino dollar. Uh, skills on hero. Yeah, it is. All right, perfect. Prize. Nacho. I have not gotten nachos yet. All right, so, big spoon down, game over. Dang, 2,000, almost 3,000 experience for one bunny. croissant go maybe she has something to say about that because I helped the croissant and then that was all no hmm. weird okay All right, Dino, let's do this all over again. Thump, 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 thump. Yes, yes, yes. Kind of cute, might be vegan. Is this vegan? Not sure if vegan. Definitely not vegan. Okay, so just running into them counts it. AKA Strawberry Short Snake. Short Snake with a long name. Oh, Mori. Oh my lord. Strawberry Short Snake. Ooh, 
this one is very much more feisty. Cat, how's it going? The bun bunny is painful. Doing good, doing good. Getting my butt kicked by a bun bunny, but you know. What else is new? Hides in its bun. And it's fun. Death to Bun Bunny. Go Bun Gee. I figured out real quick that I'm in a spot that I'm not necessarily supposed to be at yet. And uh, the monsters here are a little higher caliber than what I've been dealing with. They give me so much XP, so, you know. Donut. Prize. A pyramid key. All right, cool. I mean, that's probably very unsafe for me to do this, but... So much bread. What's with all the bread? Brown sugar bread. Oh, it's the orange dude's brother because he's a yellow orange. Eh? Where am I? Who are you? Wait a second. You look kind of familiar. The body shape, that citrusy exterior, it's undeniable. You must be Orange Joe's twin brother, Aragni Joe. My name is Aragna Joe? And I have a twin brother? Yeah, he's been looking for you all this time. Here, take this. He told us to give it to you. Gave Ragna Joe the orange crest. This, this crest, could it be? Ever since I was young and I looked everywhere for my true home. What is this? The only thing I've had to my name is this pendant with an orange shaped crest engraved on it. Same one that appears on this orange crest. It all makes so much sense now. I know who I am. I must be Aragna Joe. <laughs> Brother! Orange. I don't believe my eyes. It really is you. Where, how, where did he come from? Yes, brother. It is me, Aragna Joe. There is no mistake. I can feel it in my citrusy heart. Oh, how I've missed you, dear brother. Yes, my body is full of hope and vigor. I've waited for this day. We meet at last, dear brother. Let us embrace. Uh huh. I must thank you, children. I've thought about my dear brother every day of my life, and now he's finally here. Please take this as a token of my appreciation. I got Life Jam. Okay, I'll take Life Jam. That's actually pretty good. Yes, thank you for reuniting us. I've waited so long to find my one true home. Take this. It is a gift from me. Another Life Jam. Wait, Orange Jam and Aragna Jam? Come, dear brother. Let us go home. You're too gracious, dear brother. Celebration is meaningless. Walk together. Hope and vigor! Hope and vigor! Hope and vigor! What is going on? Okay, well, that quest was done. I... <laughs> Some oranges. Just oranges everywhere. All right. Well, I got a pyramid key, so... Moving right along. Is that a piece of ginger? Boop, 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 boop. Wait a minute. Those are chickens! And bunnies! Actual bunnies! 
Okay, the map, the treasure map said to go to the space on the right. I need to wait for an opportunity to get past this chicken. Oh, it's afraid of me. Uh, run from the bunny, please! No. Run from the bunny. Run from the bunny. Hopping around. Rabbit, question mark? What did I unearth? An X. Bunny. <laughs> well, that was something, I guess. Another spoon bites the dust. Big spoon down, that's game over. X, am I supposed to be doing this at the end of the game or something? Hope you enjoyed your dinotastic adventure. At the end of a map, and it was not one that I needed. Okay. Well. That's a thing that happened. So my question is, right? Is there more? Can I keep going? Is there more things to explore and do there? Because it feels like that's not everything. I still haven't found the perfect gift either. Hey, welcome to the flock. Thank you for the sub, Lazy. How you doing? How's it going? Nachos. Six to eight nachos is a serving size. I don't think that's a serving size. That's not the nacho rule. The nacho rule is if it's stuck together, it's one nacho. I s uh, maybe I should get a. You know, we haven't asked Mari for help yet. Yes, I need you to help me with a present for Palmy. Is there a place you can find all sorts of things? Yeah, there is. So it's somewhere in, in Dino something or other. I gotta find something for Palmy inside of here. That's what I figured, but all right. Bunny. I don't have enough dino. How many dino dollars do I have? One off. I'm literally sitting in Chicken Man's thing here. One dino dollar shy. All right, let's go back in. Fight another bunny. For it's actually a bun bunny. Bunny. I would like to give the potato spoon. Thank you. Yep. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Now let's see if I can get the uh, pyramid keys so easily again. The bun bun. Oh, it's sad today, huh? It's a sad bunny. It's just loafing around. Yeah, all the same stuff. I didn't get attacked, so. And now its defense is super high up. Good thing I got a crit. Dang, okay. Watch this do no damage. Okay, it did some. That's fine. I'll take that. Super high defense plus super high defense. does it have like do the enemies actually have a juice system like I do you're making this real easy there bunny I mean you're taking forever to lose all your HP but you're making it real easy take you down exhausted gonna go to sleep all right cat thanks for stopping by Hope, uh, hope work's been treating you well. I mean, obviously you're exhausted, so it's been kicking your butt, but you know. 
We'll catch you later. <laughs> Loafing around. Oh, I can read about the rabbit with the question marks. See what it actually is in comparison. Is it just gonna loaf around the entire game? Because I'm fine with that, but. Can I give it a massage? Am I able to use that skill? Oh. Never mind. How about a cookie for Aubrey? There we go. There we go, cookie for Aubrey. And back to loafing around. I don't know which is more tedious, the one where I constantly have to heal or the one where I just have to slowly chip away at its health. Oh lord. Can I make Aubrey attack harder? put massage on. Well, that's fine. Australia food and Japan food. Man, it looks good though. Sushi because duh. Ramen because duh. What kind of fried egg sandwich? What am I looking at here? Omurice. Weird kind of omu rice, but omu rice. Omu rice with the rice inside of the egg? That's very strange, omu rice. And a charcuterie board. Come on, bunny. Come on, bunny. Ow! Rude. Well, that, you ain't lasting more than this. Mood Wrecker. That probably would have been great. Mood Wrecker sounds like a great thing to use against someone who's in a specific mood. Pyramid Key? Dino Dollar. Okay, well now I can get the Silver Spoon. Popcorn. Man. Dang. Big spoon down. It's an interesting mechanic. What would the perfect gift be for peanut and jelly and palmy? Toast? To toast isn't. Just bread in general? Don't I, do I, art? I already have bread though, right? Yeah, I already have bread. Right, new skill. That's not a skill. Uh, skills are over here. Swing that doesn't miss and deals extra damage to happy foes. I like that better than twirl. It costs the same. Silver spoon time, that's right. Okay. 
Sick choice! Hope you find a lot of treasure. This is me, fingers crossed, hoping I can find a, uh, whatever it's called, pyramid key early on. Thump, 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 thump. I love the, the dinos in this, it's pretty fun. Also, dinos instead of uh, anything else for this digging adventure. Okay. I also hope I randomly am given a million dollars. I should probably save this, but that's fine. That's whatever. Yeah, you know what? We're going to try and run. We're going to try and run. We're going to try and run, just in case I get into some kind of battle. All right, pyramid key means moving right along. Dino pasta. Is that like dino nuggies? I better be able to get dino nuggies. Oh, hello. Parsley and a bunny, huh? Cilantro contemplates life. Sprout bunny. Ah! Leave me alone! I don't like you. Yeah, okay, you recover 199 heart. I'm gonna leave, please. Nibbles on some grass. Oh, come on. Ow! Ow! Ow. So ow. Very ouch. Okay. Red heal 60, I only need like 20. What's the cheapo thing I got? Candy. And then we need some juice. This would have been really good to just use now. That's fine though. Uh, spaghetti. Wet noodles, noodles, noodles. Wet noodles slathered in chunky sauce fully heals a friend's heart. All right, all right, I'll take that. And dino pasta is the same. Noted. Very good. Much yum. Um, fifty juices. Breadfruit juice. Tasty soda. We'll use a tasty soda out here. There you go. It's not perfect, but that's better than nothing. All right. So now we gotta avoid rabbits and oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Sprout bunny. Kind of cute. Might be vegan. I'm 100% sure this is vegan. Pretty sure it's vegan. Definitely not vegan. <laughs> Scientific name. Corandium sativium. Stats per 100 grams. Energy, 22.71 calories. Vitamin K, 310 micrograms. Uh, potassium, 521 milligrams. Iron, 1.77 milligrams. Are coriander and cilantro the same thing? Thing? Yes, yes they are. Did I run into a different one? Yes, rabbit. An abomination! Truly appalling! Come on, chicken! No. Oh, okay. The game is digging me, uh, advancing right now, so I will take it. All right, let's see what the chick's got. Oh, hello, chicken. Right, let's see what you got, chicken. It ran away. Now the bunny's gonna hop around. Rabbit, sorry. Bunnies are animated, rabbits are real. And it winks. A rabbit that winks multiple times. So the chicken just runs away.
Why is the final area just a chicken? I don't, I don't dig that. No, 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 no. I mean, that's totally on brand for me, but also I know how chickens work in game. They are not to be messed with. Poultry in motion. Ain't nothing but a chi Ain't no thing but a chicken wing. All right. Got a whole pizza. Snow cone ticket. A whole pizza. Dino smoothie. And dino jam. Something I should be. I'm a little lost. Whole pizza is great. Whole pizza is fantastic. Um, Dino smoothie also great. Dino jam also great. Dino, oh, dollar, I thought it said collar. Fish taco! Ah! Let me away, get me away, ow. Ow! Rude! How dare you turn Hero into Toast and almost Amori into Toast. Chicken. A thank you fossil. Maybe that's what I'm supposed to give as the perfect gift. A thank you fossil? That would make sense. It clucked! Seventy-four damage, dang. I defeated the chicken! Two thousand four hundred experience and eighty clams. Wow, if I can get to the chickens hold still, they are well worth trying to defe defeat. Oh, I didn't see how much a whole chicken was worth. One hundred and seventy-five hearts to each friend. Nice. Not quite as much as a pizza, but you know, I will take it. Your corner, chicken. Damn it. Run, 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 Dang it. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, I didn't die. Run, run, run. Oh, come on. Ah! Thank goodness. Well worth it for a whole pizza. All right. Find a lot of cool treasure. I did. Now, the question is, do I need to do anything else in there? <laughs> this seems like that's everything for that place. I should have healed. I very much should have healed. Was a thank you fossil be worth your while to you? Hey, hey, hey. 
I never actually looked at what it is, so let's see here. Important. Fossilized thank you card. Oh, it says thank you. T-Y. Hey! Miss Palmy has been taking care of us forever. She's always been so loving and caring. I wish I could give her something super special. Wow! Is that a thank you fossil? I've never seen one of those before. You make a perfect gift to Miss Palmy. Give the thank you fo- yes, thank you fossil to Jelly. You're giving this to me? Wow, thank you. I found this in the fireplace earlier. Maybe you can use it. A third snow cone ticket. <laughs> Miss Palmy will be so surprised when I give her this thank you fossil. Okay, the question is though. Aren't the snow cone tickets to buy snow cones? can be used as the snow cone machine. Okay, so if I find a snow cone machine. What else do I have to do here? Ba -boop -ba -doo -doo -doo. All right, Mari, what else do we have? Front row tickets, nothing in here. Okay. <clears throat> Did I explore everywhere? I didn't explore talking to him, so I think I'm gonna have to come back here at some point. I still don't know what this is about. Donut. Up here oh is this orange dude yeah it is oh they're just dancing out there ah oh, and they split their house an orange like bed an orange bed orange like fruit Ken with the TVs on can I everything's 50 50 orange like fruit orange lantern even their carpet hope and vigor hope and vigor Please come home. He is. Orange pool. You got orange shoes. I didn't mean to, but uh, thank you. Um. Thinky, 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 think. Huh. this cool love that for me uh, arrow says go this way other arrow says go this way Not the boss of me. You should have listened to Frowny Face. I guess that answers my question. Fine. Hello, Ginger Dead Man and ends. Alright, let's counter just in case. I don't know how much health y'all have. Well, you're not dead, so that's not good. Okay, they only do 13 damage. I mean, they are dead. They're ginger dead. Why are the ones inside the pyramid so much more difficult? Bites Aubrey. Uh, uh, yeah, Aubrey is now red or. Yeah, just attacking. Okay. Eighty seven damage with one hit. Dang, kid. Okay. Go 
Ghost toast? Toast ghost. Six of one half dozen the other, but all right. Hey, how's it going, Blader? I just lost juice. That's it. I mean, that's pretty significant. All right, 300 XP. Back at 5 a.m. Oh no, how did, how did, uh, said you had exams the other day, right? How'd that all go? How you been? Failed it? Ah. Uh, do you have a chance at a retake or? Is it just failed it, failed it, and you gotta move on? Maybe a little sad, but definitely not dead. Doesn't even rhyme. An unamused apparition that spouts ominous phrases like, when there is no more room in hell, the bread shall walk the earth. This one looks kind of like you, Mori. Rude. Follow the arrows. Nothing has anything to click on. in my gut to not listen to the signs. They're getting more and more frequent as well. Should have listened. Daddy bear and wheat. More ginger de dead men. Nothing compared to the, the bun bunnies in the dino place. Like nothing, so I'm fine. Level 18 now, yay! Except for, ah, oh well, we'll level up eventually. Probably this next one. Ooh, okay. Dose toast ghost. Oh, that's right, they just attack juice. There you go, Aubrey. Oh, it recovers juice as well! Cool. Creepy noises be creepy, yo. There you go, Cal. Follow the arrows and follow the stuff. My buddy just posted pictures. He's traveling, uh, he tours and does shows, uh, like lighting and pyrotechnics, lasers, that kind of stuff. And uh, he just posted a bunch of pictures from his time in Australia, and he's currently in Japan. And I don't know their time zone in Japan, but it's no longer online. So I'm assuming it's just early morning.
Or it might be... No, wait. It might be late night. Either way. Time zones! That's rude. Sorry, couldn't resist. Hilarious, but rude. Oh, angry toast ghost. Angry toast ghost is angry. Makes a spooky noise, yep. Eight juice is eight juice. Difference between a skill and not. Okay. Not gonna lie, I'm missing the like almost 3,000 experience every battle, but the battles take significantly less time. So I think if I like actually counted it up, this is taking less to do. Hundred and forty five damage. How dare you? Wow, all right, that works. I found bread, bread! Sweet, two bread. All right, rude signs being rude. You did it! Yay, good for you! All right, what did I do though? Because I just fell down like a little trap and Smells like bananas. So that whole thing was just a trap? <laughs> Thanks, congrats, right? Oh, uh, was this the super secret tunnel you guys are talking about? Yeah. Uh, okay. That's a super secret tunnel that they dug. Well, I've done all the things I can do here currently, so. Unless there's some like really super, super, super hard secret thing to find in the dino dig thing. I went all the way through it, got the thank you fossil, scratched his belly. I think it's on to front row tickets. Where do I get snow cones? That seems to have been an important detail that I missed. Snow cones, go get a snow cone. Snow cone, snow cone, snow cone. Yeah, it's all optional. Still though, it's nice and fun. Hold on, I'm not ready yet, no! Snow cone machine in Otherworld? 
Space Boy was saying I should go to a snow cone machine and get a snow cone. Woo ha ha ha! You are not a snow cone machine. I do not need a tasty soda for 100 clamp. No, thank you. Snow cone machine. I mean, I might just have not run into it. I just am gonna go to the recycling machine, though. Can. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, Laramie. We talked to Laramie last time. What makes them pirates anyways? Do they even steal anything? Okay. Now, our next destination was back at the stump. So we have to go back to the stump, and then we have to go to the Spideyverse. Welcome to the Spideyverse. You want strapped in? There's the piano thing. I never really figured out what the piano thing was, but... Might be a thing later. You got it. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. Alright. Cool! <laughs> Alright, one second here. boy. Oh, thank you. Yeah, this is typically how I have my hair. As I shave down the sides. I shave the back as well, but, uh, keep the top. I've been growing there for better part of three years now. Change up the color every once in a while. You know. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh, we can save it. I'm like, there's, it feels like there's something I need to do here. Just don't change color. Yeah. For the longest time when I was uh, in high school and stuff, I would just have a full mohawk, but I realized like having it back here was just super annoying, like taking care of it constantly and that kind of stuff. So I was just about three years ago or so. I was like, why? Let's cut it off. And haven't turned back since. And yeah, I've dyed my hair every color under the sun at this point. It's, it's, uh, occasionally it's a thing that, uh, we have the flock pick kind of a thing, but yeah. Ready to do this some more? Be right here if you need us. Right, hero? Uh-huh. Yeah, 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 of course. Spider legs, spider legs. Tons of creepy spider legs. You're no longer afraid of spiders. Sweet. Omori, thanks for taking one for the team. Takes a lot of time. That's fine. Oh my foggy. Firefly forest. I like the aesthetic. Uh, on second thought, let's look for basil somewhere else. Four hours, no skip playing. Oh, wow, really? This place gives me the heebie-jeebies. Don't be such a baby, Cal. Just some spider webs here and there. Uh, there's a spider in your hair? What? Where? Get it up! <laughs> uh, just kidding. Look who's a scared one now. Huh, not very funny, Cal. What are you doing? Nothing special. You just exist. It's fine. Okay, so I can cut the spider webs. Uh, no, more ambience. Book. Empty joke book. Pick it up. Oh, hey, look at that. Got a joke book. Tentacle poking at Still no clue about the tentacle. Oh, hey, you. Yeah. Uh, my precious possessions. More life jam? More jam packets. That's right, it was jam packets. Okay. Is that a mushroom? Okay, I can't get to the mushroom. What's this? 
Throw 10 clams into the lake, sure. Lady of the Lake, the Weeping Willow. Uh, hey, it's me, Weeping Willow, the goddess of the lake. Thanks for the clams, I guess. Say that money can buy happiness, but apparently it's not working. Can you do something funny for me? Oh, okay, so I gotta fill out the joke book. Gonna have material on you, come back when you have a joke. Ah, yeah. uh, okay. Yeah, jam packets, so yeah. Very precious possession. Okay, so thus the use for the joke book and actually picking up said joke book. I mean, they're all dad jokes. I should qualify just naturally by existing to be able to say those, but whatever. Ooh, breadfruit juice. Okay, thank you, game. And a chicken wang. Ain't no thing but a chicken wang. Okay, the question is, should I go back and get the joke? There was one in Orange Oasis. There was one in Otherworld. Feels like there was a third one in the junkyard? Or was it the train station? We'll do that after this. It usually gives time. I didn't mean to skip all that. It looks pretty fancy, doesn't it? Uh, okay. There's a USB up there. I'm gonna flash drive. Well, look at that. I didn't mean to, and I didn't. Uh, it didn't actually matter. So. Clicking on all the stuff. I'm clicking on all the stuff. Cherry soda. Hello, bunny. Hero is afraid of spiders. Oh, it's a bug bunny. Okay, I'm like, wait, was he? Why is he afraid of spiders? Why is that a problem all of a sudden? Cause it's a bug. I didn't notice the legs. Okay. Uh. Actually an arthropod, it looks, or it likes cold temperatures and rolls down steep hills for amusement. The hobby has gained so much traction that they now call, hold a yearly high rolling competition. How would you know from just fighting one? I squished one and now I know its whole background. You wanna eat it? I don't know about that. I mean, I'm one to talk. I have a whole, like, pound and a half of crickets over here that I eat, so that's a thing. <laughs> it does look very squished, though. It might, it might be squishy. It might feels like, uh, imagine eating pineapple pizza. <laughs> I don't mind pineapple pizza. Very crunchy, yes. Very crunchy. Granola bar. I'm not kidding, though, by the way. I'm 100% dried crickets. That's a celebration for uh, new followers and new subs and stuff on uh, Twitch. Fortunately, we can't throw too much of a celebration around here because it's uh gimme gimme. They're not terrible. They're just not good. <laughs> like, I'm sure you could use them as a seasoning crushed up or something, but yeah. Wiggle the woggledy. A child shouting something. Need a matchbox to light this, okay? I guess I can't do anything about this because the spiders? Gotcha, and the matchbox will do something about that, maybe? Oh, hello. Uninteresting book. Been cast aside. Uninteresting book. Dimmy. Hmm, what to read, what to read? I've read every book on this shelf over 20 times already, if only I had something more interesting to read. I can't just give him. I guess I don't necessarily have a book book. Bugs. Have you eaten any bugs before? They are definitely, uh, they got some funk on them. I've eaten June bugs too on channel. Those are, those are gnarly. Those kicked my butt. 
Oh, because you're afraid you can't do a follow-up attack? Lame, I forgot. Lame. So no pineapple, huh, Saber? Or Super, sorry. Super Blader. There's a matchbox, all right, perfect. Because I would take it one step further and imagine raspberries on a pepperoni pizza. I didn't mean to do that, but okay. Candly, sniff, sniff. I can't find my teddy bear anywhere. Last time I had him, pretty sure I was wandering through a big pink castle. I haven't found one of those. If you ever find him, could you return him to me? I bet he's really lonely. Hold it. Okay, interesting. I'll fix that in just a moment. Hang on. Uh, don't skip the bunny fights. Need to kill more bunnies. Bunnies must die. Ah, heading out to get the big kids. That's what she was shouting at me. No worries, no worries. I mean, I'm sure she was shouting something other like, you know, as toddler do. Any more track? There's more than one track? I guess it's good I went here. Okay, so I need to find a teddy bear and I need to find a book. I just skipped the bunnies again. Oh well, that's fine. You are not a spider, so... Yeah, I can actually heal this time. Because Kel definitely needs some healing. There we go. Technically, everybody but Aubrey needs healing, but Kel definitely needs the healing. 420 XP and 24 clams. Berry smoothie. Raz. Hero's afraid of spiders. So if I finish the spider up first, and we just have the potted plant you left, will you allow you to heal? Us. Will you allow you? No. No, you won't. It's because the potted plant has legs like that? It was a moving attack. Is that worse? I don't understand. It was a moving attack. Maybe that's a- it's a glancing blow. Four seventy-six. Oh, I just realized they put that in as like an anti-heal mechanic. Okay. Do not provoke. Explodes when cornered. But why do they explode? Who planted this here? Anyways, I'm glad it didn't explode. What? What is that? Explodes? I guess I got off lucky on that one. Mixing a segment, put a piece of wooden track down, yes. Single block of tofu. Yes, let's eat some. Just one. A little tiny block. You and your friends feel like new. All right. Let's, uh, let's have a picnic. How are you handling your fear of spiders, hero? Uh, breathe in. Uh, breathe out. You're doing great, hero. Keep at it. Uh, breathe in. Uh, breathe out. More used to be scared of spiders too, but look at him now. Not even a flinch. Look how brave he's being. Wow, so brave. Yeah, so brave. Thank you. I'll try. 
What can I say? I, uh, you know. I'm a big boy now. Okay, there's a mirror. Floating mirror, your friends smile warmly behind you. Thank you. Set down the wooden track, yep, yep. Oh, I didn't get the thing. Cat ears. <laughs> yeah, cat ears? Really? Where are they? Right here. Cat-like reflexes. Defense one, speed 10. Oh, so it's like the bunny ears, but worse. Yeah, okay. Already got a better one then. Uh, okay. Take the left side first. Left, middle. There's a watermelon to my left. Don't see anything on my right. Let's go left. Tomato. Nothing. All right, let's try one more time. The right side. Not seeing anything special hidden anywhere. I think we're good. Uh, I don't think that's the teddy bear, but ta giant bear. Hero is afraid of spiders. Well, this time I know to attack that thing first before it explodes everybody, so. Yum, yum. Eating the bug bunny. You know what's funny is most of the things in this game that our bunnies are considered supposed to be ed edible, basically. Painful truth. But that one bug. I mean, I guess hello would disagree. Clearly supposed to be edible. Deals damage to a foe. Amori and the foe both become sad. Not too concerned with that. I should really be using bread slice more often. Although, now that I think about it, I could probably... Uh, oh, hello, stranger. I didn't expect you to talk back to me. Mush. I am Mush. My lifelong dream has always been to be eaten and enjoyed. Will you finally grant my wish and eat me? Sure. Oh, thank you, stranger. You know how grateful I am for this. You got Mush. Oh, hello. Rare bear. I don't, I don't, I don't appreciate you, but uh, hopefully everything's fine. You know what, actually, you need to counter. <laughs> 90 damage, holy. <laughs> Give you fast food. Ow! Jeez, rude. All right. Just straight up cook. There you go. <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> Run! Didn't get a heal either of them. 650 XP. 
All right, rare bear. I wonder if that's supposed to be play on words with the, what are those bears called? Or what do they call them in Australia? That does look a part. Warning, do not provoke, do not show weakness. God, uh, yeah, clearly. Oh, we never checked out the sprout bunny or the cilantro. Oh no, yeah, we did, yeah, we did. Never mind, never mind. I'm just talking out my ass. You're afraid of drowning. That would get in the way of trying to swim then. The heck is this thing? It's kind of slimy and smells like bad apples. There's more forest on the other side of the slump. Come on, Abri. Uh, Abri. Aubrey smashed the smithereens. Oh, what's this? You're asking me for help, Kel? How rare. Step aside, I'll show you how it's done. I'm giving this stream loop all I've got. No, I have to break through it, don't I? Well, this is embarrassing. I guess we'll find another way past this thing. Yes, let's do that. Oh, thus the Minecraft cart. Minecart. Wow, clearly. Clearly, I don't know my own words. Ooh, secret area. That's the Minecraft. Oh, didn't realize I didn't switch back to Amori. Too strong to be cut. Interesting. Miwoo? Oh, no! You are not that! I get it now. Okay. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. What do we do? We swim, swim. Oh, 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 I love to swim. Oh no, I missed it. Oh, that was close. A faux tail. Okay, what does a faux tail do? Not a real tail, but it gives me speed plus 15. Sacrifice three defense and get three speed? I don't know. Doesn't sound, I mean, if Aubrey's doing her job, it wouldn't matter how much defense he does or does not have. So maybe, because he does have speed-based attacks. I'm talking about Kel. Kel has an attack that uses, uh, or that scales with his speed rather than it scales with his strength. So that would probably be beneficial. Oh, hello. A stump. Uh, okay. And there's the shadow. Magical bean. Lamp was lit recently. Is that basil? Am I, is that? Uh, 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 hi. You're not slendery at all. Daddy Longlegs, welcome to the Lost Forest, where you find things you never knew were lost in the first place. Perhaps they are forgotten for a reason. Uh-huh, right. Oh, is this a Lost Woods reference? Lost Forest, Lost Woods. Suppose we all hold secrets. No matter how lost or deep down we bury them, they find their way back to the other side. Oh, hello, Ghost Bunny.
I'm just stumbling my way through this. I'm hoping I'm doing something good. Ghost Bunny was easy to kill. All right, cool. Did it get less foggy? Hostile bunny spirits yearning for revenge. They're still kind of cute, though. Oh, the ghost bunny tells me where to go. Ghost bunny tells me where to go. Okay. Ow. Feels tired. Feels like a Lost Woods reference. I'm pretty sure it is, because it's, you know, cardinal directions. The ghost Bunny tells me the secret way to go. What is that? Never checked out what the magic bean was. Picked up a pearl. Uh, was it? Yeah, it was here, right? Purple. Magical bean, where starts battle with a random emotion. Okay. Pearl. Oh, here we go. Can be sold for clams, pretty calcium that's used in jewelry. Was that like Pokemon pearls? Trying to lose yourself or have you accomplished that already? Either way, this is the right place for you. Perhaps that's why you've come here to finish the job. Took my juice. I need that for juice. Nine juice isn't much, but it's better and it's free. but I lose like 30 juice. Oof. Um, oh, here we go. Usually we, I saw you, Basil. You were standing right over there on that path. Tend to do things we want as opposed to things we say we do. I've never been one for wants. I'm more of a need kind of person. Suggest you look for the exit before your needs become more apparent. Basil is just right here. But Ghost Bunny tells me to go this way. Stop it. Thousand two hundred. All right, Ghost Bunny. This is the way to go. You're still here. You must have either give up, given up, or you have fully embraced your fate. A confession, perhaps. I'm not the one to tell. Everybody floats in space. to go this way, bunny bun bun. There was a boy wandering here before, very similar to you. He went into the darkness and never came out. How regretful it must have been to never find who he was looking for. Be it regret, defeat, or confusion, no one will know.
Alright, Kel, take it from juice back. 11 juice. A little bit of heart. That's good. Missed. Good. Okay, a more Groot level and Loon Shun, Wind Up Throw, and Captivate. Figured everybody would get something at level 20. Level 20 is a fairly big uh, number. Deals damage if the foe is sad, it greatly reduces its defense. You didn't get one because you're still a measly level 19. Um, team Spirit, no, Wind Up Throw. Damages all foes, deals more damage to less enemies there are. Ooh, okay. You know, we don't guard much. I really should get rid of that. Um, Captivate. X versus all foe gets tired. Oh, no, 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 no. That might could be helpful, but no. Why were you over here, bunny? Okay, good. So it did give something. You have reached the end of the lost forest and the beginning of the truth. I will tell you a story that's been lost through time, a story about the creation of this reality. In the beginning, there only existed two, a dreamer and his room. Yeah, the Mori. Dreamer grew weary, weary of his room and created a door that led to many different worlds. Walking the path as a visitor to these worlds, the dreamer would come and go as he pleased. Slips and falls, tumbles and drops, the dreamer's curiosity and clumsy exploration eventually led him to a certain world. One not like the others, one painted with chaos and bathed in darkness. The dreamers slowly became filled with dread. Quiet as they may have been, words of malice kept like quietly crept into his mind, whispering lies, secrets, and truths. Powerless to silence the noise, the dreamer manifested benevolent entities in his different worlds. Then he compounded his worlds above the dark realm, sealing it with their combined might. Yet despite his valiant efforts, the darkness's presence never abated. Even with new allies, the darkness continued to scrape and scratch at the back of the dreamer's mind. Noise might have subsided, but it never went away. Dreamer could run and bury away his fears, but one still has to face his own reflection. What the Dreamer had created was something he could not be a part of, something outside of himself. Dreamer's own power was his greatest adversary. Knowledge, or the absence of it, would become the Dreamer's greatest gift. To truly escape the perils of his own faculty and ascend to a blissful state of ignorance, only then would the noise cease to agitate the Dreamer's sanity. So, the Dreamer took to another name and chose to forget himself. From that time on, the dreamer has lived amongst us, simply as an inhabitant of this world, traveling along blissfully, ignorant of his own fabrication. Children, I must warn you, as with all things that are born in and out of this world, an end will threaten this one too. Though the dreamer may have subdued the inexorable, <laughs> the inexorable, the darkness grows still. No bandage can stifle an internal wound. There will be a time when its influence will bleed through. Forgetful the dreamer may be of this peril, a peril never forgets to be. Yet, the end of this world may be inevitability. The dreamer is only one with the ability that can truly set this world free. So, me being the dreamer, I took on Sunny. Why are you in the fire? H. I don't need an H. Lost in the Pyre's Flame. Or in a Lost Pyre's Flame. Hello?
Okay, so... I am clearly the dreamer in that. And I took on another name. And hid myself by creating all these little worlds. Like I said, this is clearly like a child, like... Like a boomerang, you always come back. Welcome back, welcome back. How are you? It would be a lot quicker to just get caught by one of these cats. Cat spider things. But, uh, so clearly I'm the dreamer. I've created this world where everything is whimsical and wacky and crazy as a form of coping. Drop some truth bombs there. You and your friends feel like new. All right, is there any point to having a picnic right now? You guys talk about the lost woods you just explored through? No, no you don't, okay. Really overgrown, you're also brave going through this forest. Even an old minecart, I wonder what it was used for. I don't know, but it's used now, currently, to break through the giant thingy. Now I've gotten all the pieces. Did I pick up a book? I didn't. Yeah, like I said before, this all feels very like a kid remembering and uh, exaggerating details or fabricating little bits and pieces here and there to make it more. Yeah, I figured that's what that was for. Those look like corpse flowers. Oh, there's the big pink castle, so teddy bears in here. Look for a teddy bear, check. Can I go back down? Is there anything to explore here? No. It's just here. Okay. I don't want to wait for Pluto now, thank you. I do have that now, though. Basil, are you here? Basil, where are you? Hmm, doesn't look like Basil's here either. Hey, look, it's Mari. <laughs> Stop. Mari, Mari. Oh, hello, everyone. You all made it through the forest. I'm so proud of you. Mari, I was so scared. This is kind of embarrassing. Uh, it's times like these, I really wish Basil was here. I could tell here about how spiders are harmless and good for nature or something. Maybe then he wouldn't find them so creepy. I'm not sure if that would help him right now. Oh, Hero, you're gonna have to deal with this eventually. These things will only get worse over time. Maybe, or maybe I'll naturally outgrow it. You never know what the future brings. <laughs> All right. Ah, yes, a single block of tofu again. Ado, do, do, boop, boop. You and your friends feel like new. Let's have a picnic. This forest is a lot scarier than the one near the playground. And a lot older, too. It does have a mysterious air about it, doesn't it? I heard there used to be a huge library filled with books here. But since no one took care of it, over time the library slowly sank into the ground. Who told you that, Mari? Oh, uh, just some shadows here and there. If you focused, you could see them too. Whatever. Reading is boring. Who wants to read anyway? Where's the library now, Mari? Well, if I were to guess, I would say it's right beneath us. Like, underground? Yeah, somewhere around here, probably. 
I am looking for a book. Welcome to my shop. Nothing I really need right now. It's underneath us, huh? We already found one big secret area hidden amongst the trees. It wasn't actually, like, I more stumbled into it. Because <laughs> they press on everything as I'm going places, so... I have a feeling this is going to be easier to find than I'm thinking. All right, uh, well, I waited till Pluto's thing so I could go get those jokes. Now, I just have to remember where all the jokes are. Yes. Wait, hold on, I'm not ready yet. So I know there's one in Orange Oasis. I'm not 100% sure on where it is, but I remember there being one in Orange Oasis. And I know there's one in Otherworld. So I should probably go to the two that I know while I'm trying to remember. For whatever reason, I want to say there's one in the junkyard. Okay, <laughs> joke, joke. Joke, 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 joke. It's written on a thing, it says joke on it. Not really difficult to find. Trying to remember. Wait, 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 over here, yeah? Yeah, okay. Nacho cheese! Excellent, you recorded the joke in your joke book. Okay, that's one. Really trying to remember here. All right, Pluto, take me to the other world. Wait, hold on, I'm not ready. Was there a joke in the playground area? found out Pluto ran away. Yeah, there's Pluto. Pluto was never a planet. Joke, 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 joke. Was there a joke in the junkyard? Oh, brain of mine, please remember. Jokes, where are the jokes at? No, this was a password room. That's what this was. Would you like to moonwalk? No. Oh, I need to remember that. Also, I never explored down there because I never fought the Venus flytrap. So let's explore that in just a moment and get this one. I need to remember there's a place to swim here once I, I'm assuming, overcome my fear of drowning. All right, Kel learned Megaphone. Life Jam. Oh, that is very important. What does Megaphone do for you? Makes all friends angry. Very annoying. Got it. Lomi, Lomi, Lom, 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 Lomi, Lom is Lomi. Okay. What is to the south here? Where is the, where are the jokes? Okay, I know I've run into, I feel like I've run into three jokes. I got the nacho one that was really recent, so that one was easy to find.
Hello. Ice fishing? Fisher bear, just waiting for the next big catch. Uh, hello, snow bunnies. They're sad snow bunnies. Not quite invincible, but still. Attack did nothing. I'm fine with that, honestly. That means I got to heal for free. Seventy-two experience. Yeah, I definitely should have come here earlier. I think I'm a little higher level than I need to be, but that's fine. Why is that smushy? This was it's a yellow snow. Did I just walk? I just walked in yellow snow. Oh, uh, game. Stop it. Kick snow at you when it's angry, capable of creating the world's smallest snowstorm. Think it'll melt if we put it in the sun. Rude. Yes, but rude. Oh, this is where the snow cones are! Eh, <laughs> hat. <laughs> oh, wait, this is a ghost. Every time. Sun hat ghost. I was looking for the snow cones. That makes sense. How come I didn't know where the snow cones were? That makes total sense, because I didn't come here before. Isn't this place pretty? Snow just comes down so slowly, all the pieces seem to fall right in the, in the right place at the end. Reminds me to be patient. Hey, I know, we should go ice skating one day. Doesn't that sound fun, Omori? Knowing she is dead is making this odd. These are just things that Omori wishes that she said. Really, Mari? Shaved ice in this weather? And what's wrong with that, hero? It's so convenient. Shaved ice is way easier than come by than snow cones. What's the difference between shaved ice and snow cones anyways? Well, realistically, there's not much of a difference. Snow cones just have larger pieces. Welcome back. Then shaved ice. Larger pieces of ice? Is that why snow cones are so much more expensive? Kids seemed to learn a lot. Oh, nice. I... I don't know, Kel. I can't really answer that one. That's good. I'm glad they had a good experience. Snowcone machine. Uh, not right now. What's Jash gotta say? Jashes! I'm sorry, we are out of syrup, so snow cones with no syrup. I am Jash of many talents and master of many trades. How can I help you today? Bye. No cone for 5,000. Heals a friend. Oh, heals a friend's heart, juice, and raises all stats for the battle. Oh. That's why snow cone tickets are so good. Let's go fishing. Just Aubrey goes fishing? Oh. I got a boot! You hooked up an old boot and then threw it back into the lake. Can I actually get something from this? Yeah, let's try this again. Okay, Amori's turn. Nothing, it got away, huh? She gonna fish up a boot again? Nothing. So that confirms that the different animations can be different. Come on, where's Kel or Hero? You hooked up a vending machine. Vending machine. Buy a tasty coat. No! What? <laughs> you threw it back? Why'd you throw it back? All right, here's Hero. <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> Why would you, you hook up a vending machine and you pull it out and then you're like, yeah, no, I'm not gonna buy anything. It goes back in, boot. Old boot, threw it back in the lake. All 
Alright, we gotta go tell Kel. At least go through Kel. Gotta give Kel a chance. You hooked up nuclear waste and then threw it back in the lake. Why would we throw it back into the lake? I mean, where else would we put it, but why? Why would we throw it in the lake? <laughs> More hero. Orange! Sweet! Hooked up an orange and then threw it back in the lake. No! Why'd you throw the orange in the lake? That's valuable! We could have eaten that and stuff. Tofu! And I gotta keep it. Oh, sweet. We gotta give Kel a chance. Or Aubrey. Maybe Kel's just too lazy to go fishing? Nothing. Come on, Kel. That's Hero. Wrong brother. Ooh, fish! Plastic fish. And then threw it back. Why? The only thing we've caught so far that we kept is tofu! Alright, we're gonna do five more after this if Kel is not one of those. Five more or tell Kel goes. Hooked up at a boot. Okay, nope. Snow bunny. Oh, there's Kel. Perfect. Look at that. Perfect timing. Alright, Kel. What you got? What is it? An orange! Alright, cool. That's fun. Snow Bunny's not aggressive. Except for Snow Bunny's very angry. Bye, Snow Bunny. 12 clams. Igloo? I can't do anything. Uh, bye, ghost. All right, what'd you do? What'd you? Where'd you? Hi, hi, uh, ghost. Where'd you go? Why? What? Cold lantern, cold bed on the floor, refrigerator. But why? Cold soup. But why? Hold the ice for convenient fishing. Cooler full of ice, but why? Plastic fish mounted on the wall. Hmm, it needs batteries. No, I had batteries at some point. Fishing rods, they look like they're used often. Where did I get batteries? Also, where did that ghost go and why? Was the batteries from the junkyard? Did I get batteries just traipsing around the junkyard? I think I did. Pretty, I'm pretty certain on that one. Cattail field, other world campsite, frozen lake. Kind of have to sneeze. Check out the view. I'm pretty sure I've already done this one. I have already done this one. Never mind. Is there a joke in cattail? No, but there was this that I never checked out. <sighs> and backtracking, looking for strange table set. Looking for jokes is really beneficial. Strange floor lamp. Super glued to the wall. Dead batteries. Okay. They're bright orange, too. And the can. Strange table lamp. Many sprout moles used to inhabit this place, but a lot of them moved to merge with a bigger colony somewhere in the big forest. It was a risky move, so some of us stayed behind. My brother left with the rest of the sprout moles. Do you think he still remembers me? Uh, can I... No. Okay. I was hoping you could throw that and make a basket, but... I guess it's, I gotta be able to, you know, target something necessarily. Cardboard. Greetings, traveler, welcome to my home. It's humble, small, but it's mine. Mm. 
Cardboard. Can I recharge batteries? Is that a thing? Computer part. Be a very big sofa chair. Very big TV. Batsy. My friends used to live in these tunnels, but they all left to f look for their missing leader. Think they'll ever come back here? I don't know. Maybe. Cardboard. So much recycling. And a rubber band. Sparrows are highly intelligent creatures. Cardboard. Life jam. Most horse. First place. Is that trying to say they're so smart enough to win most horse when they're not even horsey? And the centaur couldn't even win most horse? Alright, well I got a ton of recycling to do now. Did we ever unlock- or is this unlocked now? Aliana. There was a joke here. Hate the shark airplane things, right? Why did Squareco, Scarecrow win an award? Outstanding in the field. I mean, at this point, I'm probably leveled up enough that I don't need to worry about them because I'm backtracking, but yeah, they're definitely a pain. Alright, so there was a joke here. Gosh, where's that other joke then? Is it in the forest? I feel like it was in the forest. Hello, tentacle. Well, now I'm wondering about batteries because I have dead batteries. I get battery batteries. Fifteen clams. Cardboard. Fifteen clams. You fell asleep? Hey, you know, that's a good thing though. You try to pass back out if you can. Sleep is, uh, sleep is good. Especially at, what, you're at 6 a.m. now, right? I didn't mean to put the dead batteries in there, that's too fine. I'm assuming dead batteries, I can't, like, recharge them. A cell phone. And 20 clams. A cell phone. Cell phone. All right, you got seer goggles. What's your cell phone doing? Defense plus ten. Absolute. Oh, absolutely indestructible. It's a Nokia. Got it. Cell phone better than hard hat. Okay, so we found the other joke here. Now we just need to find the third joke, which for some reason I believe is... I don't know what, but I'm playing Shrek in the back rooms while watching. Or I don't know why. Shrek in the back rooms, that's, yep. <laughs> I mean, it's, eventual, it's an eventuality, right? Back rooms and then everything's gotta go in the back rooms. Perfectly is dropping by, oh yeah, oh yeah. Uh, no, 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 not the other world. There we go, fast forest. Okay, so we've got two jokes. Perfect for those. Although I did see the, the 
the belt sander videos that they do where on TikTok and stuff where it's, you know, they sand stuff down on a belt sander. I did see them do an Nokia phone and it didn't work out great for the phone. <laughs> but it took a while. Shrek in the back room. So are you playing as Shrek or is Shrek the thing you're avoiding in the back rooms? Cause that could go one of two ways. No. <laughs> You survive, Shrek. Shrek backwards. <laughs> Get out of my swamp. <laughs> oh, Lord, you better say that. Okay, so I got to remember which tree it was, but there's a big tree that you can you can fight in here. And I say fight very loosely. Is this one? Oh, no, I think it's in the other spot. I have a feeling it's indestructible, but... I'm significantly higher level now, so I'm going to try to take it down. <laughs> Creepy Lost Woods, Lost Forest, whatever, they can't call it Lost Woods. I'll be the opposite of a tree hugger, right? Yeah, exactly. Well, I didn't mean to the first time. I just was random because I run around clicking the button so that I can, you know, just in case there's a secret thing. And I found it. I ran into the tree and it was just a big old tree. So I tried to attack and it says it does nothing. And I'm like, well, great. That's the opposite of what I wanted to do. So I guess I am the already the opposite of a tree hugger. What was in here? Oh, this is the rock. The rock with the advice. Which is a thing. Train station. Let's go talk to Leafy. Hello, fellow bunny hater. By looking into your eyes, I can see you've killed 85 bunnies. Splendid. I see you've destroyed more bunnies. 85 bunnies obliterated. Thank you very much, fellow bunny hater. Rabbit foot. Now go on, destroy more bunnies. Nothing more to ask of you. Ah, okay. Quest line complete. But I can always come back and check how many bunnies I've killed. Bunnies. Oh, here's the tree. Here's the tree. Okay. This is where the tree was. 69. All right. Where are you at? Here you are. This one. Does it do anything? Big, strong tree. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Dolphins and bunnies are evil? I mean, right? The cuter they are, the more of a, you know, clearly a distraction it is. Where's the other joke? There's another joke somewhere. Where is the joke? Is it on the playground? Anybody here got a joke written conveniently on a giant poster for me to read and then write down? No. I'm honestly, I'm drawing a blank.
Not here. Huh. Well, I guess we can go back and start the castle exploration. This way. Not ready yet. Greetings and welcome to Pluto Space Line. Back to Pyrefly, please. Yes. Sit back and enjoy the ride. Wait, did I explore the junkyard? I didn't explore the junkyard. I got lost. Ah! Wasn't there a your mom joke in there? Dang it. Really should have wrote this down. I'm trusting my gut, going and checking the junkyard. Yeah, mom, right? From the toilet? No. Okay. No toilet ramen. Life jam guy. Nothing here. difficult for me to remember. I'm sure as I continue down the game, it's going to get worse and worse and worse. You think that might be the tunnel back there? There wasn't anything in there. But I'll go double check. It's just, it's a big old poster board that says joke on the front in yellow, but yeah. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah. I haven't played in a while. I just vaguely remember it being here, so I'm going to keep going for it. Definitely not up there. No, that's scare throw. No, so it must be in here. Wow, it is deep in here. Holy moly. It must be up in that area where it's all, there's a ton of exploration. Hmm. 
Not there. Oh, there it is. Wow. Hear about the restaurant on the moon? Oh, that's right. It's the moon joke because you're staring at the moon. All right, there we go. There we go. Why did I go down there? Why can't I go down there? Why is that a thing? Oh, because there was a thing there, wasn't there? Yep. I remember now, vaguely. Okay, found the joke. That's a Mori. Wait, no, no, no. And then I go left. And then down. Yeah, okay, okay. Music beat. Okay, one moment. Do not cross. Already crossed. And now we're back home. Go away, wormhole. Okay, I don't think I remember any jokes. That's three jokes that I remembered. I, I'm pretty comfortable at this point going forward. Hold on, I'm not ready yet. Construction joke? I got the... I got the one in Orange Oasis. I got that one right there with the moon. And then I got the other one from... Shoot. I can see it. I'm assuming. No, I can't. Uh... I don't know. The Tails, the Scarecrow one. Scarecrow, because it was outstanding in the field, the moon joke, and the nacho cheese joke. But this is as far as I made it, so this is, this is the farthest point story-wise I made, so. If it's beyond here, I'm not there yet. Save it again now that we've got all the jokes and we went out of our way and took all that extra time. Uh, yeah, creepy sprout mole being creepy. Okay, got it. Cool. It doesn't say anything. More creepy sprout moles. Are these the sprout moles that were literally just the, the other one was just talking about? I didn't get it either, but I heard it, so I don't know where it is. Ah, okay. No worries. I feel comfortable that those are the only ones. I'm pretty thorough with my exploration, so I haven't heard a construction joke yet. But thanks for uh, thanks for looking out on that. Turn back. All right, I'm good. Are they all wilted and dead? Is that what I'm supposed to be gathering here? Okay. Crunch, crunch, throw. Oh, what? Uh huh. Are you made of sprout bull bodies? Ew. Oh, what? No. Uh, we're just gonna hack away at this thing here. 
Yeah, no. Um, King Crawler. Uh, yep. And... He's gonna straight up attack. Yeah, crit. <laughs> All right. 24 damage, that's it. Sprout Mole appears. I guess I don't really need to do a whole heck of a lot. It's already pretty much dead. Yeah, it's already down. All right, that was super easy. Found Sprout Mole Masks. What do I need Sprout Mole Masks for? Oh, I did get originally uh, the tickets from Sprout Mole. So is this like a Sprout Mole event? Is that what that is? Yeah. A mindless parasite that kills sprout moles and harvests their empty husks in order to extend its own body. Alright. That was an easy boss. There are a ton of sprout moles, though. Alright. Uh, if I have learned anything ever whenever I play any kind of RPG, I need to go heal. <laughs> so... I'll be right back. Sorry. Gots to do it. <sighs> I've been burned far too many times to not have learned my lesson about healing. Those are probably under important items. I should probably check those out. Let's see. What do you say? What do you say? Masks made of sprout moles. Not made to look like them. They are made of them. Interesting. All right. Um, well, they're highly intelligent creatures. They're more horse than, than a centaur. Oh, okay, there we go. Sprout Mole Village. Okay. So this is what the, the other Sprout Moles were talking about by other, other world. All their brothers and everybody left. And look, there's a save point right here. Table full of merchandise of an obnoxious looking person. Hello, strange looking Sprout Moles. Are you here to see Sweetheart's guest of hearts? If so, you've come to the right place. This sold out extravaganza spectacular will be starting very shortly. Wait a second, I know this show. We have front row show tickets for it. Ah, I can see it now. A dazzling epic tale about the hardships of romance. Heartbreak, betrayal, desperation, loneliness. Oh, the drama. This is gonna be so fun. I can't wait to be swept off my feet. I don't know, I guess it looks interesting, but now doesn't seem like the right time. But you promised we could earlier. Please, Hero, we should at least check it out. Please, 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 please. Well, all right. Hopefully this won't take too long. Ahem, if I may have your show tickets, please. Yes, of course, Mr. Sproutmore, sir. We have our tickets right here. I wasn't... No, what? Okay. I wanted to sit... Okay. Reached into my pocket and took them out. Here you go, Mr. Sproutmore. Oh, oh my! I can't believe my eyes. These are front row tickets. You... You all must have made some great sacrifices to be here today. I applaud you. Forgive me for calling you strange looking earlier. At second glance, you four are the most normal looking sprout moles I've ever seen. Please enjoy your front row seats, fellow normal looking sprout moles. Yeah, bye. Such funny little creatures. I just want to pick one up and squish it. You know, they really love tofu. I brought some tofu at a, or I bought some at a tofu stand earlier. Feel free to try some. Oh, thank you. Random free tofu is random. 
Juicy tomatoes. Let's eat some tomatoes. Oh, there's not an opportunity to sit down and have a picnic, though. So does this not count towards the achievement? Fidget, fidget, fidget. Hush, hush, hush. No name. We sprout most family mold. Do not dare leave the colony ever since the great move. It was a hard time. Many of us didn't make it. Sprout moles were getting lost left and right. Children were separated from their families. Oh, the horror. I mean, at least it's all okay now for the most part. I hate Mondays. There's two kinds of people. Brother Mole, hey you there. You creatures seem well-seasoned travelers. Can you help me out? My brother lives in the Sprout Mole colony in the other world. I was just there. I want to send him a care package, but I'm afraid of getting lost. Would you be able to deliver this? Yeah. Thank you, strange creatures. Sure, he'll appreciate it. Here you go. You got a care package. I literally was just there. Make sure it gets to him safely. Will do, buddy. I could could have done that earlier. This room is occupied. I cannot be disturbed right now. No humans allowed. This room is for sprout moles only. Was not expecting that. Double mole. We are two. We are one. We are one? Sous chef mole. How dare you speak such blasphemy? It's only common knowledge that tofu is better when served hot. Are you mad? Hey, sprout mole with decent knows that tofu, <laughs> de decent sense knows that tofu is better served cold. Hey, there's no need to fight. Why don't you two come to a compromise? Who knows? Maybe you're both right. 10 minutes to 7 a.m. Oof. Maybe you can cook tofu in a way that hasn't been done yet. Somewhere between hot and cold. Like, I don't know, lukewarm? Ew. Lukewarm tofu? That's the worst idea I've ever heard. Even cold tofu is better than that. Lukewarm tofu? I just want to throw up. Even hot tofu is better than that. How dare you speak such blasphemy. All right, they're gonna go through this again. Yeah, they're gonna go through this again. At least you don't have exams today though, Blader, right? I know they don't like lukewarm tofu. 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 All right, head chef, I'm assuming. Chef Mole, ah yes, welcome. You must be here to learn about the best culinary features since sliced bread, or feet since sliced bread, tofu, indeed. C'est magnifique. Here's your tofu trivia for the day. Soft tofu is best prepared raw or drained. It's best for desserts, smoothies, dips, and sauces. If you wish to know more, feel free to talk to me again. Ho ho ho. Firm tofu, extra firm tofu, soft tofu, raw or drained. Okay, so yeah, it's one per day. Someone really likes tofu. And I mean that from a dev development. Dev development, a game developer standpoint. Never hurts to have tofu on you at all times. I've known I've gotten out of plenty of sticky situations with tofu. Hello, flappy thing. Beautiful mole, look at me. I'm truly the most beautiful sprout mole, am I not? I mean, by certain standards, sure. Hello, sir or madam. Would you be interested in purchasing some vibe tofu? It costs you exactly one clam. Yeah, sure. Can I max it out? Thank you for your patronage. I wish I could buy multiples at once. I, what does tofu do again? Wait, wait, wait. Is this actually worth it? Five hearts? I mean, whatever. I can use it outside of it. No. Fine then, I won't go all the way to 100, I'll go to 50. I'll go halfway. Two. Three. Four. Get some by smashing pots. Okay, yeah, I'll just go to 50. Like, Link style? Just random, randomly smashing people's pots and rupees, but that's tofu? That's funny. Having a free outside of battle heal, or even in battle, but where I can just spam 250 HP, it's beneficial. <laughs> You're right. I love those memes. Like where him and Zelda finally are settling down and 
He's going through the house and Zelda's like, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Confession time. I still haven't, I own it. But I still haven't fully played through uh, Breath of the Wild. But they have a sequel coming out, so I think that's going to have to be something that I do on the channel here soon. Alright, we're at 25. 26. 27. 28. They do, they do. They very much are like Korok seeds. It's kind of the vibe I was getting at first. I mean, I'm sure there's a reason for that, you know. They're both like nature spirits or whatever, but still. I lost count again. God, this takes forever. Thirty-eight, I believe. Thirty-nine. We need 10 more. We can do this. Come on. Two. It's odd that they would do it this way and not give you the same like user interface they normally do. Like it makes it seem like there's 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 a reason. I wonder if there's an achievement behind this. Uh, most of the achievements on here are secreted though, so I can't they're all secret achievements. I can't see what they do Four more That's 50. Three minutes left. Do you get a bail? Dunce mole. This wall is nice and cold. Bunch of books, but all the pages are glued shut? Why are they glued shut? Student mole. Hey, look at this cool thing I drew. Super cool S. And there's the demon in the bottom right corner, because of course there is. A little shadow thing. D do you think we'll all still be friends after we graduate? Despite all my rage, I'm still just a mole in a cage. Mumbo jumbo. Teacher mole. I have no idea what I'm doing. Fake it till you make it, bud. Do I want to cut the wire? Not yet. Coolest drawing I've ever seen, indeed. You should uh, you should put it all over your notebook and everywhere. Egad, careful child. You could have ruined an incredibly delicate concoction. If the measurements for the experiment are not 110% accurate, chemical reaction may cause an explosion with enough force to destroy this entire village. Working on a revolutionary technology will change all life and colony, nay, the world. You're not gonna tell me what it is. And if I cut this wire? Uh-oh. I did a cool, I did a good. Well, that's good. Orange juice. Combo meal. 
Life Jam. You're welcome. Hopefully that wasn't your pet. Supposed to be a boss fight? I, I assumed as much. Squawk. Dirty laundry. Wish, wish. Dirty laundry. Dirty laundry. Why is the dirty laundry outside and the sprout mole inside? Ah, winter. Maybe snowing outside, but the winter times, friend and family, cuddling next to a warm fire, sharing stories, sipping on hot cocoa, and most importantly, taking a breather after a long year. Winter's best season, don't you agree? No. Oh, this does not bring me joy. Spring! Spring brings us beauty. Spring brings us joy. Spring brings us life. Brings us rejuvenating spirit to start things anew. No, not the best, sorry. Oh, poo on me. Sand, sun, beach, waves, not to mention summer vacation. Finally, some time to rest and relaxation. That's what life's all about. Summer's the best season. No. Boo. Fall, autumn leaves, comfy clothes, the smell of cinnamon. Let's go! <laughs> 7 a.m. Perfect time to cuddle up with a book. And with holidays right around the corner, you just gotta love fall. Yes. I concur. It's best season. Delighted you agree. Here's a gift for me. Hope you find a good use for it. A rake. Wait, can I just agree to all of them? <laughs> See, you've tossed your favor in the way of fall. You'll receive no gifts from me. Huh. Well, now I, now I want to know. Attack plus three. Embodies the spirit of fall. Floating mirror. Warden Mole. Faster men, we must push yourself to the limit and strive for a brighter tomorrow. <laughs> yep. Uh huh. Yep. Huff, huff, huff. Puff, puff. What was it plugged into? Very large, happy outlet. Is it smiling? This one's still running, too. Who's who's running on it? I don't understand what that's all about, but all right. Mrs. Flamingo. Grah! The humble abode of Rosa. Grah, grah! The number one sweetheart fan in the world. I remember Rosa. <laughs> she got 404 errored. Oh my flamingos. Family mole. Sprout moles, while intelligent, are also obsessive creatures. As you can see, I lack any semblance of self-control. Yeah, that's a lot of flamingos, bud. Oh, there's a joke. Box mole. Christmas is my favorite time of year, so why not just celebrate Christmas all of the time? You wanna cut the Christmas tree? Christmas is ruined. There's a fire outside! Oh no! <laughs> Christmas is ruined. <laughs> All that for a present. Uh, uh, sorry, bud. A flower. Like this one? I ruined Christmas. Why couldn't the bike system stand? So too tired. Da -da I am evil. I have ruined Christmas for Box Mole. <laughs> hey, you're the one that disappeared. You gotta go back down there. Flowers here? Or these flowers, right? So hard to get a good night's sleep lately. If only I had something to make experience of sleeping more comfortable. Like a bed? Flowers. You? Clicking on everything I can. Flowers. What flowers? I killed Christmas. There goes Christmas. Oh, those flowers. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 
check on all the garden. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Boss fight, that wasn't a boss fight anymore. Because <laughs> I cut the cord. Okay, so I think all that's left now is going and getting the... A boop, a boop, boop. Um, flowers for one. Go to other world for two. On the first day, yeah. So far, we are good on the flowers. Wait, hold on, I'm not ready! Not the other, wait, well, we do need to go to the other world, but yeah. Imagine, oh God, yeah, no. That would be no fun. I would not be backtracking. <laughs> Flowers. So many flowers. And check the house. Yep. If I'm coming down here, I might as well go all the way. No. Game, I swear. I mean, I get it, I do, but come on. Big old bushy bush bush. One heart. Last, we got Kells Fine. Kells Fine. Okay. <laughs> and then we go to a more. Cactus. <laughs> Whatever, dude. Okay. Heal just a bit. Seven oh seven. When do you uh when do you when are you leaving for I'm assuming you have school, do you just not have school? Still sinking. Right, oh yeah. Fire got dimmer. Well then put some wood on it or something, I guess. Look a little sad. Yeah, the crack crack is growing more and more. All right, let's go to the other world, get that care package delivered, and then head back and watch our show. Oh, sweetheart. Sweetheart. How so? Miwo? Can I go back there? 
Okay. Or do I just need to check Mewo? I didn't realize I could go back to the white space willingly. Miwo, right? Oh god, what's the name of that site? Isn't it like canyoupetdog.com or org or something like that? I know there's a Twitter for it. that? You have a package for me? Hey, this is for my brother. There's 99 tofu in here. That's the best gift ever. He knows me so well. Thanks for the delivery. I'm saving this for a rainy day, but now that I have the care package, I won't need it anymore. Got a life jam. Mmm, slurp tofu is so good. Ninety nine tofu, huh? Care package full of ninety nine tofu. I really feel like I need to get ninety nine tofu. We're not sixty nine. Oh, Lord. <laughs> tofu. Ultimate nice food. Gotta go to Vast Wars, gotta go north. The holy number. No, not to other world. Golly. Patience, Ender, patience. There we go. All right. Back to white space. Oh, you very much can. No. <laughs> no. Uh, yeah, let's go to the white space. <laughs> he was good. Meow? Did you miss me? <laughs> Ready to go. No worries, no worries. Okay. Yeah, I was going to say, no spoilers on that, though. Okay. It's all good. You didn't have evil intentions. It wasn't malicious. First time playing through. It's no problems, though. 
I do have quite a bit of uh, things for emotions and that kind of stuff, so. I'll try it once. If I fail, that's fine. There's a safe spot in there. About to save it again. Yeah, it does. It get, that's one of the first things I was saying in the first set. It gives me so much Earthbound vibes in the best way possible. Like, even the music, even the music to an extent gives me the same kind of vibes. That, like, heavy synthesizer thing. So... can't use them, I just have them. Okay, whatever. I loved Earthbound when I was a kid. I didn't get to play it because it was my friend's older sister, so I got to watch it, but playing through it later in life, I really, I really loved it. One of the main creators. That's what I named my... Yeah, I named all my... I named Sunny Omo Cat. Sweetheart, she's a goddess walking amongst us. We are so blessed. My love for Sweetheart knows no bounds. Yay, Sweetheart. Sweetheart is perfect. She makes no mistakes. Not alive. Wait, what? It is not alive. It just died. My love for Sweetheart knows no bounds. Why, are, why is one of them just dead? Sweetheart, Sweetheart, she's the only one for me. One of them's just dead? Sweetheart built her stage over the library. Ah, okay. Yeah, I did. I saw um, the Mary CD. I played it. It was like, oh, by Toby Fox. The, the, the dude who stands next to the jukebox. Why are they all pink? Because everything's pink. Yeah, they all say the same thing, except for one of them's dead. I used to only like Sweetheart ironically, and now here I am. What happened to me? Wednesdays, we wear pink. A tomato by any other name would taste just as juicy. Uh, yeah, that's not normally how that's said, but yes, that's true. I love for Sweetheart doesn't have bounds. S is for stunning. W is for wonderful. E is for extraordinary. E is for exceptional. T is for t t tofu. Mmm, delicious tofu. Not black. H is for headstrong. A e is for exemplary. A is for attractive. R is for radical. T is for th the best, of course. Wow, they, uh, yeah. God, it's walking amongst us. Came with my family. We were separated on the way here. I may never see them again. Wow. Really? Um, why? Because no. She makes no mistakes. Sweetheart, sweetheart, she's the only one for me. Amongst us. Heard that sweetheart is actually a donut. I wonder if the rumor is true. Yeah, we caught that from the Orange Oasis. That, like, picture of her with a hole in her stomach and in the donut house. She's like the donut grandma's. Pretty sus. Can't wait till like two, what is it, two weeks? It's the 10th of November, I believe, where they release the VR version. It'll be all over that. Huge stage, as amazing as I imagined. Let's take our seats, the show's about to start. Nope, got more people to talk to. Everybody's saying the same thing. Gave up my soul for the seat. Gave up my house for the seat. I gave him my college savings for the seat. I gave him my entire supply of tofu for the seat. Yeah, I feel like I need to buy 99 tofu. Hasn't even started, I'm already shaking. Amongst us. Why won't the shaking stop? 
Sweetheart, sweetheart. I go by Ender. No worries, though. I go by Ender. <laughs> Thus the name, Rightful Ender. Sprout Mole Mike. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a special episode of Sweetheart's Quest for Hearts. For our show, we wanted to take a moment and honor the life of someone who has been an inspiration to us all. Our beloved leader, Ye Old Sprout. Uh... Right. Sorry. He was truly the father that none of us deserved. Um... <laughs> Let us have a moment of silence in the memory of him. Uh, sorry, y'all. <laughs> Rip in pieces. May he rest in peace. Oof. <laughs> so embarrassing. Sorry. On to the show. They'll never know. They'll never know. Ooh. <laughs> Imagine. Last time on Sweetheart's Quest for Hearts. Our favorite princess, once again, failed to fall in love with any of our eligible bachelors. This time, we've rounded up three very or new very attractive contents. Contestants! Will one of them be able to capture Sweetheart's heart? Let's reveal them now. It's us, isn't it? Oh no, it's not. Okay. A local Sprout Mole or local of Sprout Mole Village. He's coming in three feet tall. His favorite food is tofu, has a huge collection of plastic flamingos, and enjoys long walks through narrow tunnel narrow tunnels. Give it up for contestant number one. I think I've seen a screenshot of this image. Contestant two is, yep, you guessed it. Also a local Sprout Mole Village. Careful, he's coming in hot at three feet and one whole inch. His hobbies include walking, running, and crawling. His favorite color combination is brown and green. He spends his weekends rolling around in the dirty laundry. Mmm, spicy. Give it up for contestant number two. And now for something completely different. Just number three comes all the way from Otherworld. Oh, it's that dude! It's like he just fell out of the sky, literally. According to him and us, that makes him a catch. Give it up for Snolly! Too many moles. And now, this is the moment you've been waiting for. Dim the lights, please. She emits beauty. She exudes grace. She truly has the most what? Pultritudinous face. Pultritudinous. I don't. I do not recognize that word. Yes. You know who we're talking about? Maru in the show. She's all that amazing and or er, she's all all that is amazing and wonderful, and she's just about to set foot on this very stage. Please give a big warm welcome to the one, the only, the magnificent sweetheart. Did lightning just kill Stolly? Aren't we underground? Oh no, there's a blackout. Now what do we do? I have to hap know what happens next. Let's wait it out. I'm sure the sprout moles will get the power back on in no time. Help, we don't know what to do. <laughs> help, we don't know what to do either. Help, 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 help. <laughs> As I said, ruined it. Help. Well, maybe we should look around just in case. <laughs> what? Help! Okay, you guys just say the same things. You guys just say the same things. Okay, so we clearly gotta go down. I was wondering what the giant outlet was for. Wow, I guess the blackout affected all of Sprout Mole Village too. Hero, what do we do now? Don't worry, Aubrey. This is where my handyman expertise comes into play. In cases like this, we should probably be looking for some kind of backup generator. Not gonna help suffer. Right? Not my job. I paid good money to be here. All of the, the not money, because they got lost and I killed them. Wait, is anybody actually affected by this? Do they care? Fidget, fidget, hush, hush, hush. Nope. All 
Are you Team Rocket blasting off again, Mr. Fidget, Fidget, Fidget? Hush, hush, hush. Also, how's this still going? Look at that. There's a convenient three extra treadmills now. Pick up the pace, boys. We must make haste. We're trying our best, Warden. This is as fast as we can go. Why isn't it working? I feel sick. Just keep running, moles. Nothing gets done without a little sweat. Oh, now there's four. This wire isn't plugged into the outlet. Plug it in? Yes. Ba -bam. And now everything's brighter. So difficult. What I say, Mool? Hard work pays off. Now keep running. Uh, let's exercise together? Hero at a very leisurely pace. Kel at super run space. <laughs> Bye, Hero! Do they give up? Do they all give up at some point? I thought there was going to be some kind of mini game where we all had to run, but no, we just had to plug it back in. Okay. Everybody's smiling. Faster men, we must push yourself to limits. Strive for a brighter tomorrow. Same thing as last time. Take back my alignment there, badly. Let's go back to the show now. Everybody, we saved the show. It was us. Uh, but you, know, you got a top hat for. So, and please help me, mustache mole. I'm in need of a handsome young gentleman. You, yes, you there in the striped pants. You're a magnificent beast. Yes, oh, look at Joel just fine. Or you look like you'll just do just fine. Uh-huh. Wow, uh, well, well, thank you. I don't know what to say. Please, kind sir, will you help out a poor lowly mole? I'm desperately in need of your service. Well, since you asked so nicely, how can I refuse? Thank you, thank you, young lad. Young lad. You're too generous. Please come this way now. Chop, chop. Wait, ho hold on. Can't my friends come too? Oh, yes, your friends. You're all here to sw see Sweetheart's Quest, yes? If so, you will all meet again soon enough. No, come, sir. We must make haste. Time is short. Hero left the party. Rude. Yes, ready to take our seats. Shut up. Greetings, sweetheart fans. We apologize for the short intermission. Welcome back to our regular scheduled program. During the break, we regret to inform you that a tragic accident has occurred right here on this very stage. Another one? At this time, we announce the sudden loss of contestant number three. We'll remember him fondly for the few seconds that we got to know him. Not sorry about this one. Yeah, he was kind of rude, so no. Truly a unique and irreplaceable soul. That's true. And now let's replace him. But the show must go on. Please give a warm welcome to our new contestant number three. Hailing all the way from the vast forest, it's our hero in shining armor. In shining pajamas. Get this, guys. Hero's a real hunk, standing at a whopping 5'7". His passions include baking, cooking, and cleaning. And if that doesn't sound like a perfect man, check out his killer smile and mild personality. And now, once again, it's time to introduce our star of the show. Dim the lights, please. She emits beauty. She exudes grace. She truly has the most pultritudinous pultri pultri face. Yes, you know who we're talking about. She's all that is amazing and wonderful, and she's just about to set foot on this very stage. She's the one, the only, the magnificent. Whoa, ho, ho. there we go. I have to look that number, that word up later. Whoa, ho, 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 ho. Whoa, ho, ho. An excellent entrance, my liege. 
Ah, uh, yes, it is me. Hello, my stupid, annoying fans. Hello, my sweetheart, you're the best. Yeah, you're the best. Oh, ho, ho. sweetheart, we have brought you three of the best bachelor bachelors in the world onto this stage. Will today be the day that one of them steals your heart? Let's start with some questions. One thing that sweethearts values most in companions is complete and absolute obedience. Do you, contestant number one, agree to pledge your allegiance to sweetheart for the rest of your life? Contestant one, what is your answer? Uh, sure. I don't know, I guess. Playing hard to get, I see. Now, what do you think about that response, sweetheart? Just three feet tall? Maya, that is much too short. Send him off. To the dungeon! What, what, what'd you say? The, the dungeon? Oh, hello. They have armor and swords. And are picking him up with no hands. Help me! On to contestant two, we ask you the same question. No right or wrong answer, just answer truthfully. Contestant two, will you pledge your allegiance to Sweetheart for the rest of your life? Uh, sure. I mean, if they won't get sent to the dungeon. My word, this one. His very being offends me. Take him away, boys. I was gonna say, they caught him. Yep. Knocked over the mic. Yeah, great personality, I'm sure, yeah. Looks like you're the last one standing. I'll ask the same question one more time. No pressure at all. Do you, Hero, agree to pledge your allegiance to Sweetheart for the rest of your life? Well, no, that doesn't seem fair at all. Why would I do that? My, this one. He's absolutely immaculate. Could it be? Is Sweetheart in love? What an exciting turn of events! This must be fate. A match made in heaven. W wait, but I just said... Oh, yes, yes, you'll do just fine. Now, what was your name again? Uh huh? It's, uh, it's Hero, ma'am. Hero, my hero. We must go to my chambers at once. Guards, I have chosen my suitor. Take him away! Guys, please do something! Can I move? Whoa, Hero's gonna marry Sweetheart? I didn't see that one coming at all. Kel, what are you saying? We have to help him. What do you want me to do about it? I don't want to go to the dungeon. Ugh, Kel, you're so useless. Hero, do you have to- You have to reject, Sweetheart. It's time, Hero. Your princess awaits. Whoa! Uh, I don't think she's gonna listen to me. Just do it already! Okay, I'll try. Excuse me, Sweetheart, ma'am? Yes, my lovely hero? How are you yearning for the sound of your sweet voice? Say my name again. Wow, haha, that's so nice of you. I mean... Uh, why do I have to do this? Ahem. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but I'm not interested. Why, whatever do you mean, my prince? I, uh, this is all really flattering and all, but you know, we only met just like a few minutes ago, and, well, I have to reject your, um, offer? Oh, pish posh. Oh, don't be silly, hero. I've never heard anything sillier. It, it's true. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but... I don't want to marry you. Understandable. This, this is preposterous. No, this, this is blasphemy. You dare reject, sweetheart? Everyone loves sweetheart. You hear me, everyone? Send him off to the dungeon. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> hey, stop right there. You can't take Hero. He belongs to us. What is this now? What is a non-sweetheart fan doing in the audience? Ah, I see. You must be Hero's fans. Nerve of you lot. First you make a fool of me, and then you interrupt me during my own show. I'm the one who makes the rules around here. Guards, take them away. Oh, okay, they're everywhere. Now you've done it, Aubrey. Are we going to the dungeon? Or are we fighting? We're going to the dungeon. Ah, man, now we're all stuck in the dungeon. Sorry, guys, it's my fault. We were all in this mess. No, it's not, Hero. No one could have predicted what that would happen. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, because we don't know who that could be. Mustache mole. Oh, 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 okay. Well, I guess we don't. You fools. Don't you recognize me? Rosa, it's me, Rosa. Number one sweetheart fan in the world. I told you that you'd all pay for crossing me. Curses, we've been bamboozled. I should have known you're behind this, Rosa. It's true, what they say. Revenge is sweet. Now rot, you peons, rot in the dungeon forever. Oh. Dang it, how are we ever gonna get out of here? We'll find a way. Come on, guys, let's think about this. Where do we even start? Not like they'd leave the gate unlocked, would they? They're very intelligent beings.
Looks like a job for Aubrey. Oh, oh, these are the jars I can smash. Link style. Tofu. Tofu. No. Tofu. Okay. <laughs> Nothing. Harold. Harold? How odd of a name. Harold. Such charm. Nachos and tofu. So much tofu. Uh, Harold. My, my boy, my, my buddy, my pal. Master of the Blade, a Sproutmole who has studied the art of combat for many years in order to be granted the prestigious title of Harold. It's a title. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, one moment. I got ramen from the toilet! Why is that a thing? <laughs> Why is that always a thing? <laughs> ramen in the toilet. Hello, Mari. Can you press the button? Hey, it's Mari! Mari, help us! We're stuck in the dungeon! Oh no! It's the button. Yeah! There you go! Now come here and enjoy a nice picnic with me. I promise you'll feel better right away. Convenient Mari picnic is convenient. And random. Tofu? Is that pickles? Am I about to have a meal of pickles? <laughs> I don't eat my ramen in the toilet. I don't actually like ramen. But that's because I'm a super taster, so... Salty things are extra, extra salty for me. I may qualify that. I don't like the freeze-dried ramen. Fresh ramen's great. Hero, I have a question for you. Is there any chance in the world that you would have said yes to marrying Sweetheart? What? No way. You know I only have eyes for you, Mari. Ew. He was right, Kel. Hero, that is not what I like about you at all. What? It's not? Then what is it? I can't tell you that, silly. It would ruin the magic. Okay, I don't really get it, but whatever you say. Mari, you don't have to tell to worry about Sweetheart at all. Sweetheart is the worst. Can't imagine anyone being in love with her. Wasn't she Captain Space with Sk Captain Spaceway though? <laughs> Relationships like that are just shallow. You can't compare it to the real deal, like what me and Omori have. Isn't that right, Omori? Omori? <laughs> Every time. Hey, gang. Seems like you're all stuck in a little pickle, so I snuck in some pickles. Ah, yuck, I hate pickles. Next time, can you sneak in some jam instead? Uh, okay. Where's this one go? Job for Aubrey. Screw school, I'm a watch stream. Don't skip school. School's boring, but you know, it's some of the best times, best years you'll have. Believe me. Mori looks like a Gudetama lazy egg when he's at the pick. He very much do does. I just saw that they're making a Gudetama show. Right? Don't skip school. Got sent to the dungeon for smuggling. Old habits die hard. Smuggler, Josh. That's what I said. I've got some choice words for a sale patron. Interested in buying? Sure. Online school. Wait. Oh. Okay. Well, still. Oh, I can buy them now, but they're more expensive. Yeah, they're making a Gudetama show. How much do I have? 56? 43? 99 Tofu, what are you gonna do about it? Yeah, I saw the advertisement for it on Netflix. I think you just have to look it up, Gudetama. This one has, has an axe taped to it. Marsha! 
Is Marsha a title as well? Yeah, it's true. As much as I do appreciate you hanging out and wanting to wanting to chill, but uh, there is important things as well. I will come back, and you're more than welcome to come back at any time. You know that. Tofu, tofu, tofu. Contestant. Oh no, what are we going to do? No one ever escapes the dungeon. I mean, I'm here. No, wait, 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 what? what? Hey, come back. Not alive. Yep, it's a skeleton. That's that's definitely how skeletons work. Prisoner more. Huzzah! After countless failures, I've finally almost made my escape. All I need to do is find the exit. Can you... Can you move... I hate you. You're right in front of the button. Spooky, scary skeletons. Um, oh, a job for Kel. So this does make a comeback at some point. Hmm. Okay, good, good. Hate it. Stupid prisoner mold. I like how in the pictures, the background changes to the area that you're at. Nice touch. Good on him. I mean, this still is an interesting feature considering it's like we're taking a picture, but Basil's supposed to be the one with the camera. So who's taking said picture? More picture foods being uploaded in Discord. Gum syrup? I've never heard of the term gum syrup. What is gum syrup? Right? Yeah, who would be taking said pictures? Wait, they have a button that's designed to explode that that sprout mole? That's a thing? How did they design that one? Orange juice in his cereal instead of milk? I mean, he likes orange juice coffee, so yeah. 100% agree. Oh. Well, this is just the way to go. I need to go explore the... the rest of the place. Ten clams. Ten clams. Two clams. All right, we got some more exploring to do really quick before we do that. Why does that one look like a ghost? We may never know. Okay. Let's start up here, where we came out originally. Bum, bum, bum. Dang, you got that crit. Needed you to, you know, let him. Oh, you know what? I have tofu. Brian to level 30. Whoop, whoop. Come back here. This one. Uh, tofu, please. Look at that, eight tofu, already fully healed. Gate won't budge. Is there a max level in this game? Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. Because sprout moles. That dino place was pretty dang good for, for grinding. 
Oh, look at that. I'm already one step closer. <laughs> Why has everybody got a small amount of damage? Because they all leveled. That is so strange. Yeah, it is a good one. I was going to say, there's... That, that spot where all the oranges were seemed, but that's not a lot of XP, but yeah. I like the dino. The dino place was really good for not only getting a bunch of healing items and that kind of stuff, but, uh, can't catch me. Oh, nice. But getting a bunch of experience as well. Max attention and reduces all foes' hit rate. Meh. Gate won't budge. And then this is where I was before. I really farmed anywhere else, so I wouldn't know, to be honest. Yeah, earlier when I was doing the, the Orange Oasis, which is... You know, I explored everywhere. I went and did the, the dino dig thing, and the dino dig thing got me, um... Cost 100 to get in, went in, you could fight a bun bunny and get 170 clams back, and something almost like 3,000 XP. So, I know. 69 damage seems to be where it's sitting, which is kind of hilarious to me. And that was just the bunny. Like, I didn't even go farther than that. Or Toy 69. This is not Fruit Punch. Noted. Is that blood? It's not Fruit Punch. Mrs. Flamingo, a special hell for you. My dear, what? Signed, sweetheart. This is a special hell for me? Nourishment. Cardboard boxes, no other reason to take up space. Bunch of books, all the pages glued shut. Is this supposed to be for Space Boy? Oh, but the mirror makes you look especially unflattering. Yeah, this is... Lens is covered with tape, okay. This is supposed to be, like, his room, but... And there's their special song. What happened over there? Scrabble just booked it through the wall. Okay, odd. Okay, so now we go back underground. We go back up. Press the button. This one, yeah, this one goes up. You wanna enter that room? Look there. Finally at the exit. Woohoo! Freedom at last! Let's get out of here. I never want to see another spam mold. No, not yet. Oh, yeah. Ten clams. More clams? Nothing the second time. Oh, whoa, 30 clams. Dang! Okay. That's a good place to farm some clams. Okay. That's it, though? What is that thing? Sorry. A key? To a warrior. Dove. Hey, 
gonna stab you. No, it's just eyeballs. Oh, 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 that kind of key. Got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense then. It <laughs> did not look like one at first. That makes sense now, though. Bye. Have a good night. Okay. Stuck here. It is alive. I've been stuck here down down here so long. I barely feel feel like I can barely move muscle. Eh? What's that face for? You don't have any muscles. Death peanut butter. Found it that fast. Yeah, that's that's my go-to. Is uh, okay. That's not creepy at all. Put my put my mind in the mind of dev space. I mean, yeah. All peanut butter is death peanut butter. Under the right conditions. This bone has a bow. It's not alive. It's not alive, it has a bow. Tentacle poking out of the ground. Tentacles important. Is this... Supposed to, I mean, that's supposed to be the main characters, is it not? <laughs> Magic! <laughs> it's not alive. This is clearly the main characters. Aubrey in the middle with the bow, or the second one, yeah. It's a good question. Perseverance? curtain I mean that's easy he just steals blood and just has it owns it <laughs> only eyes and no skin magic eye life jam not alive Alive, not alive. Come on, heal Aubrey. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we never checked out Marsh's details. Assortment of lethal weapons. One of them is missing. That's ominous. I missed one in the forest. Master of the Axe, a Spratmole who has studied the art of combat for many years as the order to be granted the prestigious title of Marsha.
Okay. Here's my. I've got a key. I need a button. And I need to get up in that. All right. Excuse me, my. Let's go. Did I say spam? Caster blaster spam. All right, good. Yeah, I knew I missed one. Ramen! Stuck down here for so long, I feel a <laughs> move muscle. Same joke. Spamton! Oh god. I have a... VTuber file to be Spamton. On my list, though. Yeah, it was in the game suggestions, but I didn't play it yet. Welcome to. No, I don't need an eye either. I didn't get the G. Didn't end him? Rude. There we go. Okay. Out of my way. Out of my, out of my way. <laughs> Wait, actually, there's good money to be made in here. I know, Harold seemed invincible there for a second. Welcome in. Sweetheart's Castle. Duping items in Minecraft be like. Another person! Indeed. The dungeon. Uh. Sorry, guys. Oh, someone has a bow. Do you really think you could escape that easily? Back to the dungeon to where you fall. Darn, we were so close to you. Uh-oh, what do we do now? I think, think, Harold, think. Come on, how do we get out of this? Oh, I got it. The masks, yeah. Ahem. On the contrary, Sir Knight, I think you're mistaken us for someone else. <laughs> yes. Hem, hem, don't be so quick. Er, quick. Judge quick. Quick to judge, we are sprout moles, indubitably. Ho, oh, ho, indeed, yes, quite. I am also a lover of tofu and sweetheart. Mmm, delicious sweetheart, I mean tofu. God, my eyes must have deceived me. I apologize, brethren. It's rather hard to see through this helmet. Very well, carry on then. I will resume my patrol. You lot have to return to your stations. Well, as well, at least our dare sweetheart notices. How's that for some quick thinking? That was smooth, Hero. With these sprout mole masks, we'll be able to make it out of here in a cinch. We really have to keep wearing these, Hero? Mine's getting kind of itchy. Yes, Kel, we should keep them on until we get out of here. Come on, let's move.
Okay, that's a thing that can be done. Candle bunny, pyo. <laughs> Harold's party rolls initiative. That's a 14, it's anybody's game. Therese. Oh, D&D &D references. 14 on initiative is, is, is damn. Now the question is, can they get higher than that? Like, is that, is that? Ow. Rude. Level 22. Just Omori, though. It's bound to happen. Why, why is this a thing? There's gotta be a reason. Gra! The Royal Kitchen. Gra, gra! Servants' Quarters. The Royal Ballroom. It's 8 a.m. Can I still break these as Aubrey? Yes, yes I can. Ooh, 25 clams. 30 clams, dang. Don't mind me, just uh, breaking stuff right in front of you and you don't seem to care. Initiative, it's a seven, it's anybody's game. They roll a 20, do they automatically go first or something? These are questions I must have answers to. You're gonna go to sleep? All right, Blader, no worries, get some sleep. Hopefully you feel better. Thanks for hanging out. It is getting about that time anyway, so no worries at all. Thanks for hanging though. Catch you next time. Level 22s all around. See ya. And enchant. And becomes happy. Okay. Why? 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 Ah, royal chambers, royal gallery, royal library. Ooh, library. We need a library, though. not fruit punch still not me trying to chase and horribly missing nat 20 has the upper hand ah yep yep confirmed also marsh is the leader of the party ow marsha falls over makes total sense Okay, there we go. All right, 926, and I found popcorn. Even better. We like a popcorn. Oh my lord. Why? Why? Butler mold. Please let me and I promise I'll write you a good review. Let me through. You don't know how long I've been waiting to see Sweetheart's latest work. Back to your stations, you two. You know guests take priority. Thou shalt not pass. Uh... The Royal Gallery. This month's feature is... A vu of Sweetheart. Oof. Oof. Guys, stop it. You aren't helping at all. Uh, we're supposed to have heralds guarding the entrance to the show, but I heard they're... They all got held up in the ballroom of the library. Whatever's going on must be quite the event, even if it's more important than Sweetheart's latest showcase. Oops. 
Oops. Oops. Oops. Oops. Oops. Welcome to the Royal Gallery. Please enjoy the complimentary tofu. Welcome to the Royal Gallery. Please enjoy complimentary tofu. You can do every- or she, no, Sweetheart can do everything. She can paint, sing, dance, even make movies. I just wish she would notice me. Notice me, sweetheart. Notice me. Hey, man, you okay? You got no color in your face. What if I have plans? Uh, hello. That is a giant eggplant. Cat Pyramid, what a fantastic show. This visit was well worth the trip from Orange Oasis. Welcome to the Royal Gallery. This month's feature, ooh, the sweetheart. Yep, yep, yep. Soy sauce? Galleries are all about showing off cool stuff. They should be showing off me. <laughs> showing me off. I'm cool stuff too. Uh-huh. Wow, I'm beyond moved by this work. Brell. Unabashed display of the artist and mint's ego is truly breathtaking. Basket case. On the way here, I accidentally stepped on Sprout Mole's foot. She called me a miserable peon and slapped me silly. <sighs> I must have hurt her foot really bad. <laughs> Crown. Princess Ghost looks around aimlessly as though lost. These paintings, they have awakened something in me. Gluten? I hope it's not permanent. Tiffany, darling. No! -ho -ho! Showing simply magnifique. Dwan thought Doan understood. Dwan thought Dwan understood art, but after coming here, Dwan is starting to second guess himself. Well, you know. Hey, it's Maestro! Behold! Isn't this the finest piece of art you've ever laid your eyes upon? You got ramen. Well, so you fished around in the garbage for a toilet? From top to bottom, a Sunday without s or with sweetheart, sweetheart night. Mona, sweetheart. Scream, heart. Top to bottom. The creation of sweetheart. Sweetheartnica. The birth of sweetheart. She just replaced herself in all the famous... But, uh, yeah. Sweetheart with the heart earring. Sweetheart crossing the Delaware. Sweetheart eating a burrito. The swing. Sweet time. Okay. Oh, this is what I need. You gotta go to sleep? Glad you gotta find my channel. Whoa, welcome in, CJ. Hopefully we catch you next time. Enjoy yourself, have a great night. Seven keys left. There's a hole here. Go into the hole. No, wait, whoa, no, wait! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I didn't mean to do this. What was that? This is Basil's place. Okay. All the photos of them all permanent marker did it out. All crossed off. Photo album, right? Okay. Amelia, wow, it's quite the showroom. It's still, it's strange. I don't remember the castle being here before. Maybe I'm just imagining things. I see a face in the wall, doo da, doo da. I see more clams and stuff, also face in the wall. Don't know how that works. Hey, but whatever. Jam packets. Is that because I completed a word? Does that complete a word? No, it doesn't complete a word. that about? I went to Basil's place and all of the photos were scratched out? I want to go to karaoke too. I'm going to sing my heart out of karaoke we this week. No one could top my cover of Don't Stop Sweetheart. Don't stop 
Sweetheart. Me and the boys are thinking about going to karaoke this week. You guys should come and join us. Statues made of crystallized tears of sweetheart's enemies. Wow. Nah. What are you? Uh, oh, that makes sense. Lucius the mage. Nat one! Dang, Skippy we do. Nat one. All right. Let's get Kel that heal going. Sixteen damage. Well, of course. Heal one. Got to heal now. Heal a different one. Okay, what do we got? Yeah. Man, it's been a while since we saved. Kind of wandering aimlessly here, but. Oh, you know what we haven't done either? Master of the Arcane and Master of the Bow. They all say the other same things otherwise. Royal Library. Grab. Reminder, no reading without permission. Can't let them get educated, apparently. Good, bad, there's a ghost, and a line of people. Oh, is it a book signing? Wow. Oh, hey, there's a fancy book right up there. How dare they make me wait. I'm an esteemed guest. Pink mole, pink mole. Okay. Not strawberry syrup either. Hello. Nereen. Well, it's been a while since I've seen you four. Up to no good again, I presume. Have you learned your lesson after venturing out of the tunnels? Next time, you won't be so lucky. Pages are all glued shut. Comes off a bit pompous. Wait, is that trying to say that Noreen recognizes the dead bodies of the sprout moles I'm wearing? Do they make me wait? Everybody says the same thing. Okay. You are not pink, though. Teacup spirit. Oh, I have a question for you. Think ghosts would be considered a gas? Uh, uh, no. You can interact with gas. Good, red, bad, blue, yellow, green, or orange. Or I guess that's pink. Guess this mole. Oh my, there's simply no time to admit entry to all these unruly guests. Just goes to show that we mustn't ever underestimate the popularity of our dear sweetheart. You there, servants with the ugly faces. Upcoming main event has a strict dress code. The utmost importance that audience is dressed to sweetheart specifications. Simple chart that even a non-sprout mole can understand. Ah. Okay. So if they have any color but pink. Lesser guests to follow you and bring them to me. You can do something that simple, yes? Uh, how many sprout rolls? See, there are 13 guests improperly dressed. Oy. You don't know what I've been told, sweetheart's love is good as gold. I know they make me wait. Yes, you can follow me. Don't touch me, you look like you have germs. Ah. Follow me. Greetings, esteemed guests. Please follow me. Your presence is urgently required. My, of course, you do look clean, upstanding gentlemen. Do I have to make a snake? Oh, yeah, I do. Okay. It's 
Uh, yes, I can do something that simple. Yellow. Yes. Please follow me. Presence urgently required. Finally getting center stage. We have yellow. Yep. Steam guest. Present is urgently required. Oh, I just want to see my only son. We have blue. I just noticed the candle bunny. Candle bunny. Well, what do I gotta do? Yawn. Green, bad. How dare they make me wait? I'm just gonna read the line that matters. About to stand in another line? I mean, kind of. Laws of this land are cruel. Of course it is. Of course my presence is required. I don't know what I've been told. Sweetheart's love's good as gold. Strawberry cake that smells like a beet. Do you want to take a bite? Yeah, sure. It's bad. It's a bad thing. Is this not good? Oh, welcome to Conga Island. We're doing the Conga. Maybe I gotta get everybody first. That does something special. Longest conga line. You. Greetings, esteemed guests. Well, me, present surgeonly required. Dang, I knew I picked the wrong tie. Uh, you. Me? They've got to make an exception. I must go to the show them my a piece of my mind. Um, you are blue. Greetings, esteemed guests. Follow me in the presence of the bird. Oh, okay. You have to explain to what's going on. I don't have to, but yes. Do 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 do. This is big boys to Alpha Three. The jig is up. Abort mission. Psst. Are they not? Are they not following me then? How dare they make me wait? Fine. <laughs> Whatever. Of course, the staff is wonderful here. Okay. Pink, 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 pinkity, pink, 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 everybody's got pink, 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 let's go do the conga thing, cause now I have all of them. Conga Island. Splendid, I knew you had it. I had, yeah, you had it in you. Now I can finally be rid of these unpinkish guests. Guards, escort these sprat to the dungeon. I don't know what else I was expecting to happen there. And that takes care of that. Those unpinkish guests will never see the light of day again. Sorry, guests. You got book. There's another couple books, yeah? Also book. Interesting book. It's interesting. I don't know what I've been told. Sweetheart love, good as gold. Yep. More book. More book. Poetry book. 
Okay. Where it gains more X or EXP. Oh, interesting. Okay. Should do that for one battle to increase. <laughs> it's not as good as diamond, right? Ugh. Should do that just to increase Kel one time. Ugh. Okay, uh, the other one was important stuff, right? So, the interesting book, poetry book. A toy? Oh, it is. Yeah, yeah, I've gotten one of those before. Okay. There's the next battle. Not exactly how I meant to do that, but you know, that's, that's what happened. Just tell me. Perfect. All right, Harold. Ow! Rude! You move fast when you want to. Okay, did that even him out? Not quite. One more battle should do, though. What's in this first room? Sweetheart Special Team Crumpets. Yes. Oh, healing. You and your friends feel like new. Sweetheart's throne. Watched every episode at least six times. Can't go over there. Oh, Sweetheart's in here. That's not where I want to be right now. That is not where I want to be right now. I'm sorry, that's not where I want to be. Where did I just go? Totally what I was expecting to do. Yep. Well, 100%. Well, the whispering's normally nice. What's this? Uh, totally normal. Totally nice. What is going on? Oh, hello! How are you? Keeper of the castle, you are brave to speak to me, young ones. Tell me, are you enjoying Sweetheart's castle? That girl, she was an elaborate one. This dwelling, it takes the shape of one's deepest desires. A place to return to. Somewhere to call home. Sweetheart came to me a long time ago, a poor girl from the desert. She begged me on her knees to make this place hers. I gave her what she desired, a castle full of riches, servants for her to command, and a stage for her to flaunt her power. Yet, she still wants more. I must be, a, or it must be a curse. Soon she will leave and not return, I know this. When I've deemed that she has found her home elsewhere, I will look for a new owner. At that time, return to me, you with the empty eyes. Your soul is split. You can only choose one path. It'll be interesting to see what you will make of this dwelling. Me with the empty eyes, my soul is split. That would be the alternate paths in the game. That's interesting, though. So I have to come back after she's left. Huh. Hello, Lucius. A nat 20. Damn it, Lucius. You're too lucky. Ow. Did something magical. Okay, that should even Kel back out with them. Yes. Okay. Now I don't have to do that unfortunate version of this. Um... Funny years, there we go. Where Kel doesn't level up like everybody else does, because I let him die one time. I heard the keeper, I will return later, indeed. Uh hello. Sir Maximus, stop, imposters, I know what you are. You are not sprout moles. Mm-hmm. You must be wondering how I'm able to tell. You see, I'm above those feeble and inexperienced heralds and marshes. I am Sir Maximus. Most impressive lineage, I will be victorious and bring honor to my family.
impressive. No, I I cannot fail now. My son needs me. Your son? Uh, but excuse me. <laughs> non stage five idiot sprout mole, right? Uses ultimate attack. Ow, ow, ow. Rude. Wow, dude. Strikes twice. Damage. I don't think you're gonna survive this slash, but sorry. Eight hundred XP and tofu. Well, mm, sorry, Maximus. How does that work? What was that? That was just, huh? <laughs> what does this do? Throw one clam in the fountain. Yeah, sure. Uh, yeah. This is just a time waster, isn't it? Hi. Of course. <laughs> oh, geez, look at the size of this crowd. We'll never get through at this rate. Let's look around for another exit. Hmm, maybe the crowd will die down eventually. Check back here later. Pluto? How are you... But with the blood and the how? Not watermelon juice. Pluto! It's beautiful. Virtuous one. No, 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 no. This won't do it all. You in the center left, you call that singing? My cousin's plastic flamingo sings better than you. And I don't think I can see you in the back dozing off during the chorus. Pull yourself together, Odin. Sweetheart will have thrown in the dungeon. Uh, these sprout models seem to run into some trouble. I wonder if there's any way we can help. Hey, guys, y'all need a hand? We're professional helpers here at your service. Oh, thank goodness. Professionals have arrived. We absolutely must have a choir ready before Sweetheart's main event. Simply isn't enough time. You see, we sprout moles become very sleepy when listening to music, so as you can imagine, the choir keeps putting itself to sleep. Uh, I'm afraid we must to resort to alternative methods to keep them all awake. I see. Not to fear, my dealer sp sprout mole. I know exactly what you're talking about. Y you, you do? Thank goodness, we're saved. Should have expected much from such professionals. I'll handle this good, sir. You can trust me. Uh, right. Peach soda. Is Kel gonna throw- wait. I, assuming I gotta be Kel then, right? Is Kel gonna be throwing stuff? Is that what's going on? And fries! Peach soda and fries. God, where is the save? A music machine? Sound of drum makes. Quack. That's the sound a drum makes. <laughs> Smells like the ocean, sure. Jam packets. This is so very random. Underwater theme stuff for no reason. Hey, 
Okay. Mr. Versa Wilson Mulser, I am all ready to go. Thank you, gracious professional. We are in your debt. See me sensing improvement already, but I wonder if we can do better. Do you want to try again? Uh, yeah, I guess. Whip us into shape. Yes, 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 splendid work. With your help, the main event will surely be most glorious. Looks like it's time for the event. It means we only have enough time for one more session. One last shot? Yeah, sure. Believe in you, professional. What? We just gotta keep doing this? Is that what this is? I get it, I'm throwing tomatoes to keep them awake, but it's like, it's still interrupting the music. Yes, I just better work with your help, the main event, of course. Thank you for your time, we'll try to make do with what we have. Thank you for your time. Was it recording it? I don't understand if I did good or bad there. I don't understand the point of that at all, but all right. I don't know what I've been told. You guys keep saying the same old things. <sighs> want to dance too, but no one will be my partner. Will one of you dance with me? Yeah, sure. Okay, I won't disappoint you. Huzzah! That was so much fun. Ah, what is this feeling? My heart is racing so fast. Thanks. <laughs> Did I just heal? You and your friends feel like new. That's, that's a healing station thing? Okay. Royal Ballroom. A reminder, karaoke is Fridays only. Punch. Is there not a save somewhere? I'm making a lot of progress and not getting any of the saves. I mean, is this this is the kitchen, yeah? So is Mario gonna be in here? Nope. My dear sous chefs, I'm afraid my back just can't take it anymore. It is as unfortunate as the time I announced my retirement. But wait! Chief, without you, who will lead us in our task of making a most magnificent cake for the event? Sous chefs! It is now time for one of you to step up and take the limelight. Cake must be baked today. Our very lives are on the line. Oh yes, I hear you, Chief. The most capable one of us, I will volunteer to take charge of this task. I won't fail you, I promise. Okay. Hey, you there. You four are sous chefs now. 
Meet me in the kitchen pronto. Just <laughs> yeah, that's how that works. Who are you? Who am I? Good luck. You're going to need it. Good luck. You're going to need it. Good luck. You're going to need it. Okay. Back to your stations, newbies. Don't take kindly to slackers. Hey, have you seen Sir Maximus around? That guy owes me some clams. I have studied the art of combat my entire life. If you all work hard, maybe one day you too can become a Lucius. Take our job seriously. Sweetheart's Royal Guard is the only accepts the best of the best. There's Mari. Okay. Gazes wistfully at Sweetheart's portrait. Bed for sprout mold. It smells like dirty laundry. Obnoxious looking person, as we are all new. Okay. Bowl of sweet strawberries. Let's eat some strawberries. A booker da boop boop. There are sure are a lot of sprout moles here. They sure love sweetheart. I tried offering one some food earlier, but she called me a peon and threw it back to me. Sprout moles are peculiar creatures, aren't they? Just that one in particular that everybody keeps running into. I didn't mean to save as Kel. That's odd. I didn't know you could do that. There we go. All right, well, on that note, I'm gonna call it for the night. It is getting pretty late. It's about that time. So thank you for coming out and hanging, chatting. Uh, boom bang. I don't know why all those emotes, oh, cause we got some subs. I don't know why those emotes exploded just there, but they did explode right there, so. Yeah, interesting. I didn't hit that button, but thank you for coming out. As I said, I'm gonna drop some links if you haven't checked those out already, please consider doing so. There's all sorts of fun stuff there, including, uh, you know, Discord, Twitter, Instagram. Uh, I do streaming on Twitch on weekends, Friday, Saturday, and Sundays. We do community type games. But in the end, there will only be one Sunny or Amori. True. And uh, yeah. So if you want to come over and play games with me instead of just watching and hanging out, you're more than welcome to do that on Twitch. Otherwise, I will do this every Monday and Wednesday. And yeah, if you want to stick around for that, please hit that subscribe button. It's free for you. It really supports me a lot. So please consider doing so. Same with the like button. And if you want to get notified directly, that little bell icon will let you know as soon as I go live. But yeah, otherwise, thanks for coming out, everybody. And I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.